He can't move, he's stuck. <laughs> Okay. Nothing to do with the console, it's all to do with my capture equipment, unfortunately. It's just it's just been shit in the bed and I don't know like exactly why. Uh, but it is pretty annoying to say the least. Sorry that like some of the things on screen are like kind of being a bit of a bedwetter, but uh, it, is, it is what it is right now, guys. I'm really sorry. being like slightly slow on camera but so I have to do that. oh I just realized what I said. Alright flow is looking good on the stage though. Honestly, it's looking really good right now. Um, so yeah, you should be able to hear me a lot better now, guys. I'm sorry that it's been a bit all over the place at the moment. How's this for y'all? Do we both? Do we all like? Can we all hear? Can we all hear just fine? Um, so yeah, Liam, uh, nothing's gonna come through the cans. Testing. Nothing. Yeah, nothing's gonna come through these. Oh, okay. They're coming through these speakers because I forgot a thing for this. So I can't. I can't tell if I just. Uh, uh, no, you can. Horrible noise for the. No, you can. It's just coming out of the speakers though. So that's our little booth monitor. Nice. Yes. Nice. So yeah. Anyway, we're looking to mount, mount a comeback here. He's doing some damage, but he won the first game. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, we almost had it. That would have been pretty significant. So hopefully we should be without audio issues now, everyone. We should be. Um, also, rather, we should be without capture issues because that's what was happening before. Um, and it's just uh, been a bit annoying. Yeah, oh, what a read. I want Flare to take this just so that we can see another match. Yeah, see, see who really deserves to win this set. Yeah, I, I want to. I really want to say that like Flareats is Fox has the stuff to beat Caleb's stuff. I think. I think the, the opposite is true too. You know. Yeah. I think it could no, go either I, way. I, I, I agree. I agree. Right you are, Jim. Right you are. <laughs> <laughs> um, right, he's down one right now. Caleb, not really known for making comebacks, but let's see. Let's see what he does with the scrap. 
Oh, it's kind of like the right play there, wasn't it? Really? Get up. I guess that makes sense because uh, theoretically he did it no matter what, so at least with the get up tech, he gets Wait, he waits. Oh, so right when the guard shoots me to get the back boost. Oh, oh that's the, it. He tried the fade back, but Florette's nice. had it called out from before he even tried. Nice. Good job, too. Alright, now we get the now we get the deciding game three. Good round. This would be such a glow up for Caleb if he takes this. Looking a bit stiff there. Caleb gets a hit. Not getting not getting a huge amount off of it there, but since starting to rack up. Caleb likes to he likes to kind of play defensive for a little bit, and then he just sort of uh, pick, picks a moment and goes in. But he thinks it will work. Because uh, Forrest is a bit more likely to just kind of wait and see. Dude, Jack's playing pretty nice right now. Yeah, but he gets knees. He has the DI to keep him alive, which is good. Still up. Nice. He nares and then he waits and sees, sees what he does and then uh, punishes the roll. Oh, some good nares from Florette's keeping the corner there. But, oh, grabbed. Greedy with that last one. Keep him out of that, Caleb. Don't let him back to stage. No. I Don't think go it's down interesting there. that Caleb is choosing to stay underneath the platform. I think it makes sense because it means that Fox can't do a full hop near Adam from certain angles because he went on the platform. Mm. But, um. It doesn't seem like Friar is actually looking for that. It's yeah, nice. It's the bad end of that stick. Right. Oh, lost the double jump. He's totally dead. Lived him. What a valuable up there. It's a valuable. Yeah, Caleb loves to shock on these platforms with up there. It's like, what do you just? He'll 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 just do it if you're on a platform. Expect him. Expect the unexpected when it comes to the yeah. Caleb. Yeah. Oh, Pirates kind of misses up a crucial pickup punish there, but he's going to keep it going. Anyway. Yeah. This is that position that like all Falcons hate because they are forced to go high and just get hit over and over again. But it is what it is. It's part of the game. Yeah. Should have thought about that before picking the character. Oh, gets the, gets the bad hit of up, uh, up smash. Almost gets punished. Pirates is doing a really good job. It's not staying on like the ground of the stage, and he's moving to the platform so that Caleb doesn't get a free grab on him. I think he's also just doing a bit better of a job at, like, when he when he gets Caleb in the corner, he's hitting Caleb nice, a lot more. Nice, that's it! Yeah, I like that. He's get, he's hitting Caleb a lot more when he gets him in the corner than vice versa if Caleb gets him in the corner. Yeah, true. He's just boxing him out, but Caleb's, Caleb's trying to do that, but he's just not quite doing it. Yeah, like, you can see there, he's getting screwed. Caleb has a small chance. Oh, not with those crits. It's duck Wait a minute. This Wait a minute. Everything right now. Nah, I think so, but... Does an aerial when he ends up on the other side of the stage, though. So... Nice. He's keeping it going. Got one chance to close yeah. this duck out. One hope, one moment, one dream. I don't think. Yeah. There's the hesitation. Nice. Oh, yes, sure, though. Beautiful bird. Though one way of shine to up smash could be everything. Yeah, it's right pretty now. much one back air, even that. Yeah. Oh, getting dead. very greedy with that up smash, but it's probably not going to matter in this situation. That's yeah, Caleb's had juicy. such good luck with these up -bees so far. Yeah, it's like the fifth time it's happened. For us. Wait a minute, he's making it happen. <gasps> big, the big, DI? Big, big, big. That's it, that's it, roll up. Yes! yes. He's got oh. one more shot, he's got one more shot. This is all or nothing for Caleb, it's do or die. Oh, he waited Florets for it. only needs a few hits though, and if Caleb, but if Caleb can keep the eye well, <gasps> Wait a minute. this could be his. Oh, he's out of it! Ah, the crap. Great decision from Flores not to go for an up air there, and that's going to be his set. Honestly, not a bad job by Caleb towards yeah. the end, uh, but even though he lost, I think he's looked a lot better than how he looked on Friday. Yeah, I, well, I wasn't there for that, but that was a pretty good game. Well, wow. yeah, not bad, not bad. Caleb has the stuff to, All right. to no, do. I got to say. Oh, you're up. I'll All be right. exposed. All right, good luck, man. So we got lemons and Scrattles up next. The Scrat Daddy himself. I wonder if Glimms is going to play Fox, actually. Caleb was playing pretty well. Caleb was playing pretty well. 
so we got Scrattles and Lemons on. Oh, there we go, guys. I fixed the, the choppiness of the, the camera. It's a little bit. Yay, I'm a genius. I fixed it. Now, surely these guys are not getting straight into it. No, we're not. So this is winner's bracket still. Yeah. 
the FTC monthly is turned into like casual basically because they uh, the capture card didn't work. So unfortunate, but it is what it is. Um, thank you for the people that are following right now though. We're gonna be getting Muska and Fly Rats winners semis on stream now. Take! Ah, 
Back on the microphone for a little bit while uh, while this game's going. Uh, if anyone is in chat and knows the score, please let me know. Um, but it looks like Farad is still sticking with the green fox like a madman. But he's taking a stock. Love that. Love that for him. to hit a shield drop drill, that would be so good. Yeah, if anyone um, in chat knows what the score is, please let me know, because uh, then I'll be able to put that in. Oh, first drop of the punny. Mask out with all the practice in the muscle. Uh-oh, big chance of throwing it. It doesn't go down in China. So he's gonna lose his stuff from that, basically. Oh, he got makes it back. Doesn't need an honest attack either. Must have misses up the punish. And he's off stage. Oh, the soft back is not gonna do it though. Frat's just content to use these back airs to try and eventually win the stock. But it's only got a certain amount of chances left before he gets it. Oh, must be pretty crazy up there. Almost oh, finished. Up smash? I guess uh, up smash probably needs to connect it if I'm being honest. Oh my god, the angles are just so good for Muscle. That's probably going to do it though. And that's the game. Muscle wins 3 0, I guess. Alright. So that would mean me and Scrattles are up next on the stream. All right.
Hello. Hello stream, what's up? This is Musk oh this is Musket here, joined yeah. with Jeff, the one the only. Uh can we need to change No we can get just doing hand warmers. Yeah, they're doing hand warmers once we you know once. Yeah. This should be a fun match to watch. I've been playing a lot against Brad. He's improved quite a bit, over Yeah. The, like I still can't get over the fact that he does a up throw up throw on me. It hits me every time. Oh yeah. It's really is it like we it's perfect really deep, but yeah. Look man's reasonably comfortable against Puff, it's good to see, it's good to see. Yeah. Um Promise he's not playing Puff right now, he's playing Falco. This is a matchup yeah. that a lot of boxes don't enjoy it. Don't, yeah, so, sometimes. It feels like Falco laser can just cut, sort of... It stuffs out your neutral. It kills you momentum. It stops you doing the things that you want to do. Fox is used to just using his, um... You know, a lot of times using ground movements. Like, just dashing ground and... Oh, yeah, we'll, um, we'll go in. Yeah. Should we scoot the camera a little bit? Yeah, we'll... We'll see. Yeah. So, um, so where do you think they're going to head first? I reckon, like... Battlefield or FOD. That's pretty good. Tiny bit. There we are. Perfect. <laughs> Where are they going? Uh, probably not FD. Oh, no, they they oh, they they're mine, they're mine. They're <laughs> no, they're they going to land. You think? Oh, yeah. yeah. It's a more fun stage. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Me too. Um. Yep. Cool. Cool. Alright, let's see how this goes. Yeah, I did not play well today. But it was fun. I just didn't expect to play in the tournament. Wait, what was that song? I did not play well today. Oh, yeah. well, but it's know. fun. It's a good learning experience. It's you know, get you, get you, when you're not expecting the tournament. Wide. Tournament, yeah, exactly. It can happen anytime. Yeah. But I'm, I'm setting up a computer. So I'm able to That's play Melee more consistently. More than my thoughts a week. Because I think playing in big bursts at melee really does not you can to play as a whole. Like one big burst a week, yeah, and then like you just get burnt out for like the entire week of a week. Like, as opposed to like half an hour. Smaller, consistent um, sessions are definitely a way to go. Yeah, it's far better. Nice, already. So this is a big stage, um, has a very, well, not a very high top light, but has a top light. And I um, want to see how well Brad's able to use it because it definitely feels like one of the booms for Fox in the stage is the ability to kind of like pull hop and then if he doesn't like, if he doesn't like coming down that moment, he can double jump and then like reset sword on the top light. Yeah, absolutely. And Brad is so good at like carrying people across the stage. Like he does these neat little short hop nair, short hop nair, short hop nair against yes. people. But I'm interested to see how he will convert it onto the drink run platform. It's a that. The big thing is just getting um, very comfortable in you know, our pairing and acting like it's not just enough to just like do a basic up on that platform. You want to fast forward, you want to L cancel it as soon as possible on platform, you want to be able to act out as soon as possible yeah. out of it and you know, Because a lot of times Falcon's not just gonna check in place or um, you know, miss tech. Oh no. That's always such an awkward position where you jump out and you're like you're far away enough that you can't just like double jump and then shine immediately, so you're like stuck yeah. in your base. Oh. <laughs> this is looking there, this is... Yeah. Well, I mean, it's game one, it's and game one. Oh, it's yeah. definitely not over. I know, it was, it was looking pretty over there. Yeah. It was looking pretty over there, but he brings it back now. Yeah. That's, yeah, that's, that's, beautiful. that's where yeah. he... And he almost got into the Firefox as well, but not quite. Okay, this is... Look. It's I, a game. It's, it's a game again. As much as I was... All it takes is 10 seconds and one whiff. It takes a good combo. A good combo or, you know, cheeky shine. Yeah. Cheeky See shine that? Stage. See how the lasers just stuffed out? Like, he was trying to just dash dance in place or play mind games and a laser comes in. He has to shield and he has a little bit of lag. He buffers something he doesn't want to do against it. So that interaction there. Now, so, Fox went for a drill. Sorry. Fox went That's for a drill and uh, Falco jumped and 
was in like airborne for like a few, I don't know, maybe like a split second or so. Because Falco was airborne, um, the Fox Drill basically, it, basically Falco landing um, cancelled out the Lightning Sun from the Drill, which immediately um, was actual like, standard landing like, and he was able to grab it. So, uh, that was that game. This is now when uh, uh, we are. Uh, yeah, I just fixed the score. Yeah. Oh no, I, he lost. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, yeah. <laughs> um, all right, when the, the classic FD. This is a very single swim stage. For yeah, I didn't know. I didn't know about this pick because it seems that if he was having trouble with neutral on Dreamland, where he has platform to open, he's just going to get played by lasers here. Yeah, the punish game is really it's nasty. Amplified. Ooh. You really have to be. You, like, you have to be very confident in chain grabs, and you have to be very confident in chain grabs in the moment. It's one yeah. thing to just be able to hit them in friendlies or you know, in sex. Yeah, whatever. The tournament's entirely different. Like it really is. Everything feels off. Everything feels kind of shittier when you whiff it and far more gross when you hit it. Yeah. I I got a, a funny rest on Kylo. He was playing Falcon, and he like. Down aired me at zero percent, and I tucked, and then he went for it again, and I just jumped into him, rested him before he could get it. And I heard like the audible, like the <laughs> so, yeah, <laughs> exasperated sigh. Yeah. You love to hear it. Yeah, when that's, why you that's why you play Falco. Falco is off stage. Goes yeah. high. He has to eat. He pretty yeah. much has to go high. Yeah. Falco had already grabbed it. There we go. And he's safe. Oh, that see, was... see, see the carry. Oh, yeah. He brings him across the stage. I love watching. Oh, not quite. If it was a little bit faster, he would have um, thought it would have been off stage. But oh, this is good to you. Uh, comes, tries to come down with a better to protect himself, but Hyzer is scouting it out. Yeah, this is looking not the worst. Yeah, because this is this should be it. Yeah, and now right. he needs he to just get up one grab. <laughs> he needs to get a grab. Yeah. One good chain grab, and he can't get chain yeah. He's going to grab, but he can't get too antsy for the grab. He can't just run up and do like raw grabs. He has to like, uh, you know what I mean? Yeah. All right. Good shit to Kai. Yeah, nothing too bad. That was, um, yeah, that was wonderful going back. Okay, Yosh, this is also Yoshi's, another good scene. Yeah. He kind of just rushed Falco down a long time. Yeah. yeah. You can still have the platforms for mix ups as well, like climbing. I think Brad's hitting his tempo now. And I uh, I actually like this matchup uh, for Puff v Falco way more than like playing on FB or something. Because it's a lot more compact and you have platforms to play with. So I wonder what it's like for Puff. Oh, not for Puff, for Fox. Uh, the big thing as well, this is like, that's just a general rule for all Foxes out there. If Falco is on a side flat, don't run up. And take from me, as someone who's done this a lot, don't run up and try and like, Hit Falco with a full hop nail or something. Don't like do like a rising full hop nail. Yeah. When Falco's on can he platform. catch you out on it? If, if he's shielding, then he can still drop shine. Mm. Like, oh, yeah, good point. If, if it's a rising aerial and you're still in Falco's like shine range, then you're just getting shine down. Oh, that's for like rough. <laughs> yeah, that's. <laughs> back you're getting out shield drop shine. Yeah. 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 You can sense the two. Yeah, that way it sucks. Falco yeah. has a lot of little things where um, sometimes Fox messes up slightly and. And you buff the wrong move, or you make the wrong move. He definitely like has a lot of um, a lot of dishonest, a lot of dishonest punishes at times. But, um, it's not like the Falco is going out of his way for it. It's just like a lot of like just incidental. Oh, this worked. Oh, he's like the box messed up. Well, I guess I get my he got hit by my side B. Well, I guess I get this stock. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. yeah so. That's free. I, that always. Well, you have to like you have to, you really have to shoot uh, uh, the eyes to the yeah. You but, know, it's like, really it's still... It, but Falco doesn't lose anything. Like, he can just go for it. He and can. If it misses, though, like, Fox can probably land. Um, for Falco. Yeah, that's it. Well, that's right, it. Good All stuff right. to oh. Kai. Now we're off to what match are we watching now? Uh, I'll have to check on Bracket. We will probably do some losers quarters games first. Sweet. Um, four winners finals. Awesome. Yeah. And off goes Muscat. Play chat. Ooh. Yep. Just feedback. Yep. Alright. Good stuff, Kai. Alright. <laughs> Game hard. Yeah, that was a cool last start. Hello, Devin. 
yet to see you. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? It's one the only. Um, I won the match. You did. I'm pretty happy with that. It was fun to watch. Thank you. I'm surprised he went to FD. Game two. Ah. Uh, nah, you have to do FD at least you once. Think? If you fuck. If you fucks, you have to do at least yeah. one FD. I mean, your laser's one point, so I think that's why. You were like stuffing him out every time. I didn't even it. laser that much. It, it was like at the right times, and plus the the shield pressure. Um, it looks like Scrattles is actually just going back up for yeah. the match, it seems. Which would be loser's quarters, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. loser's quarters. That would be a loser's quarters match. Um, I wonder who was playing. Sorry? wonder who was playing. Well, it's Caleb. Caleb. That's cool. Look him go. Yeah, he's improved a lot. The thing is, he's playing more like none, which is his kind of play style. Yeah? And I think the, the more he replicates people that he plays, like, the, the more fun he's going to have and the better he's well, going to be. Well, his punish game just needs to be much more consistent, and he needs yeah. to be able to pick up punishes when they drop. You know? Like, um... Have you seen Sora's video on that? So, no, I have not. Okay, so, um... Basically, it's a concept where you are trying to essentially, like... Make yourself react when you know the like punish is dropped, you know? Yeah. Yeah, so like uh you basically wanna not do anything when you've already realized that the punish is over, you know? Right. Some people so keep you trying to do like the attacks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not like an overextension, right? But it's like they don't know when it's like not their turn. Yeah. They don't know when to like just wait for their turn to come. Because yeah. it will come. It just like you just have to wait for it. Yeah, I see foxes all the time when I'm playing puff. They'll like jump off stage, shine with the shine when I'm off stage, and then go for a back there. Like you're dead. You die off of that. Yeah, yeah. You, you can't do anything that. at that point because they just jump under them. They don't have. To, they have one yeah, option. Yeah, that's over. They fire fox. Right. It's really silly. So basically, the pickup punish game that happens is like. You have to just not. You have to not buy it, you know? Like, you have to just. Look at your meal and not play with your food. <laughs> it's already served to you. Like, it's served to you on a silver platter. You just drop the knife for a little bit. Yeah. You know, you're just fumbling it, trying to get it into your mouth, and then suddenly. You drop the knife? Suddenly, you drop the whole plate. Yeah. And the punish is gone. Yeah. But. But if you do the little things like dropping a knife, you can still come back. Just, like, pick up a fork instead. Yeah, so. I think it's just like that's the way you should play these uh, fast ground moving characters. Is like you have to put yourself in a position uh, so that you can just dash to where you need to go, right? Yeah. Because moving left and right is probably the quickest action you can do in this game, aside from like wave dashing left or right. Yeah. So you just gotta be ready for when you drop it. Yeah. Watching Caleb yeah, play. Caleb's yeah. Watching him play now, as opposed to a, a, a few months ago, when he didn't have that player, wasn't playing that often. It's pretty huge. Rollback's yeah. done a lot. Yeah, really it's had. good to see Caleb a bit more practiced up yeah. against like other people. Because I think he plays heaps like by himself, right? But like he just um, doesn't have that exposure. Autopilot kind of. Well, yeah. When you're playing by yourself, if you're not like trying to like practice yeah, with attention, yeah, it's just gonna be this uh, practice that's not gonna actually help you in tournament. Yeah, it's sort of it's kind of mind. Yeah, it's you like basically just wanna like make it so that. I was speaking to Stradles about this earlier, like the longer you play melee, the harder it is to not autopilot. Because like you think yeah, you're learning stuff and then you start autopilot. Like I, there was like this huge like period where I was playing Puff and all I would do is like full hop back air, like double jump and then like do a, like a nair auto cancel. And oh, I was right. like, why is this killing me? It's like it's just killing you because everybody knows that you do it. Yeah, you're yeah. doing it over and over and over again. So and so I wasn't even thinking about it. Yeah, I was talking to like Jack this before, but like uh, one thing that like stops people from getting to that upper echelon is like, they're not waiting to see if the other person is reacting or just, just pressing buttons. You know? Like yeah. you have to sometimes like the best players don't stop to do this. They just keep playing and they, they just watch them like how their actions change. Yeah. Um, but if you are like wanting to turn the tempo of the game in your favor, sometimes it does just help to stop and like really look at like what the other person is doing and then wait for them to like do something that you're ready to react to. And then suddenly it's your punch. 
Yeah. Because that's what the neutral really is, but people don't play it like that all the time. A lot you know, of like, people play it just to throw out something and hope yeah, it hits. Yeah, just throw out something, hope it hits, and then like I'll react to the pickup after. Right? <laughs> yeah, and it doesn't work. Yeah, well, it's, uh, it's hard to like, it's hard to always play in a way that like, oh, <laughs> this is a combo. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Oh, that is sick, That was a ridiculous yeah. back air. I'm surprised it hit. It probably hit like the top side of the back air, like where Falcon just like chest is. Yeah. And it's probably just the top of the That's it. Oh, we got a game. Yeah, this is actually a match. Yeah. This is actually a pretty fierce match right now. Is this best of three or best of five? It's best of five, so uh, both yeah, these players cool. made it to... So Scrattles made it to win his sentence. This is probably going to be the start there. Yeah. yeah. Well, he only has one option there. Yeah, basically. So much you can do. Yeah, good job. Yeah. 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 Ready? Fair enough. Like, Such a base stage. I think this is probably what you want this as Fox anyway, because it means he can't ride the wall with his Falcon. Mm. So if you're Falcon... You yeah, can't exactly. Because that's the... Uh, that's a downside to going to the against Fox. Yeah. It's like, he gets that little bit of wall, and he gets a lot more than run He's yeah, like, she's... he's not that much slower than the Falcon, really. I think Falcon has some shit on Yoshi's against Fox, because his hitboxes yeah. cover oh, so much yeah, of the stage. Gee. Personally, I would say Yoshi's story is a better pick than the Fox. Yeah. Uh, the Dreamland Fox, because, like, you're Falcon, you're already probably going to be living off the top. But if you go to Dreamland, it just means that you make the Fox against the Fox. Yeah. Like, he's never going to go against the Fox. Nice. Stop me. Um, whereas on Yoshi's story, he will try to kill you off the top, and like because Falcon's so heavy, he actually gets to live a little longer than some other characters. Yeah. Plus, it's harder for Fox to get the after up there on him, uh, which is the main like kill combo. So when you take that into account, Fox is like main avenues for killing that aren't shine. Do like they just get nerfed by playing against Falcon anyway. Yeah. So you may as well pick a stage that you can kill people on like, you can kill people on like 50% with an easy. Yeah. That's a good point. Oh, that's stock. <laughs> that's a stock, baby. <laughs> Thanks, Redwood. I appreciate the compliment. <laughs> oh, I love the wave dash down after the jabs. Underrated okay. tech. Oh, oh. oh, I thought he was dead there. Some monster name. He actually fucking <laughs> that's ramen, man. It's no, instant. I, yeah, I love when Kale gets to me so much. It, it hurts to, to have, but like at the same time, you're like, what else he did you think bro. he was gonna do? <laughs> yeah. Hell in, that's your fault. I hate playing a uh, uh, Puffy and Falcon, because like anything above him, anything above getting hit by an up air, you just get combo, combo, combo. Ah, uh, yeah, true. Because down throw into knee is confirmed after like 2%. Yeah, <laughs> it sucks. It really sucks. Do you think, um... Do you think it's hard for Falcon to play against Puff, or is it actually... I don't think it's bad. I think they... It's like, Falcons just try and play... Whoa. They try and play melee against Puff, and you can't play melee against Puff. Yeah, you have to... Puff should, because if they go anywhere where the up air hits, they're gonna get hit. But if they crouch and shield, what you have to do is you just have to spam down those at them. Or... Or uh, try it. you can't like attack their shield straight on, and never try and like grab unless you see them landing, because right. they can just stop. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Good shit. Where are they heading? What do you think? Uh, you Yoshi's. Yeah. You think? Uh, probably you want to be going. To... Don't come out of. Nah, no, you can't. You can't. <laughs> you like, yeah, fair enough. Yeah. 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 See how that, like, dumps place then, what they are in real life. Yeah. I haven't set up so that you should Dude, you're breaking the, you're yeah, breaking nah. the illusion. Nah, there is no real life, it's just melee. It's yeah, you're right, this isn't even an offline tournament. Yeah. Like, we're, we're all just actually actors, and, like, the feed we're getting is from so Yeah, Caleb's just <laughs> We're the, just acting that we're at the tournament. Caleb's just the deep fake. Yeah. This is this isn't Caleb on stage. This is actually like <laughs> just a deep fake client event that we yeah. like prepared in advance. It's oh, Whoa. he lives. I have to see it. If he if he waited to do that now, he could have done a back air and got him off stage. Oh, yeah. big grab though. That is pretty. He's cool. going off stage. He just needs to pick up his edge. Yeah. Guard. But 
Oh. Both these guys just fighting like a little too early on their just respective edge guards. Should have played it safe. You know? Yeah, just yeah. wait. Yeah. Ooh. It's like when Mewtwo King, whenever he sees somebody do anything but uh, <laughs> counter against the fox and going from the bottom of the stage, he's like, why would you do that? It doesn't work. Like, just do the counter every time. I don't care if you have to waste 15 seconds. Just do it. Yeah. It, it works. It so works. It, it, it's just really hard to tech. Yeah. Nice shine. He's keeping him off stage with his back is. I like what I'm seeing from the girls. That's it. This is how you want to play this. You just want to keep meeting Falcon. Yeah. Nice. Good. That's just so clean. So yeah. clean. Falcon's so exploitable in that situation. Yeah. Like, it's just a no win. When he's that high up, he's just going to get rocked. Super it's hard. so rough, too, right? Yeah. Like, man. Oh, he's doing it again. Look. Just the back of this. Yeah, there's nothing to do. Oh, good dash dance, actually. I like that Scrattles knows that he's got a big lead here. Oh. Oh. No. He does not throw it away. Did he almost just rock crop himself? What? You think he almost just rock crop himself? No, he really did. He could have died off of yeah. that. <laughs> Caleb could have capitalized if he grabbed the ledge. Yeah. Nice. But the punish is just too clean from Scrattles this game. Yeah. The stage is just working out so well. Because usually, I think what it is, is uh, at least part of it, is when usually you land on either side of the stage, you hit a platform and then Caleb gets an upper off of it, but yeah. you're just going straight down. It's unfortunate for Falcon because, like, this is the one stage where he actually doesn't have really room to run because yeah. there's no platform. <laughs> Which is funny. Yeah, yeah. It's a, yeah. It's a flat stage, stage right? Yeah. But, like, he actually has nowhere to run. I think escape is, like, the, the best thing. Like, he, he can't really catch his breath. Alright, going to Dreamland for this uh, almost second to last game. So. I'm excited to see this. I want to see Caleb get another game on the board. I don't mind that he went to um, I don't mind that he went to Dreamland here, but I can't help but feel Yoshi's might be a bit more helpful. Cause yeah, well, he just everything kills so early. Yeah, in my opinion, I reckon like if Scrattles wins this, they're going to be going to fight for the next game. Oh, oh my god. Sorry, the uh, Spidey Sense is stinging. Spidey Sense? Yeah. <laughs> you think? <laughs> yeah. Don't, don't need to say it. Yeah, just... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Scratch just can't land a nair on Caleb. He's actually running. He's he's running this stage all to himself. Yeah. Look at this. Yeah, I went to... I love seeing uh, nice. Caleb play Dream Man. It's a lot of fun. There's no way he's going. He's got a jump. Yeah, but just... Save. Oh, yeah. yeah. This will be so nice. Beautiful. You'll love to see it. Oh, I liked what Scrattles was going for though. He just messed up. Yeah. Here's a chance to, like, oh. see even if he can clean this. Let's try it. Wow. There's kind of... Do you think there's a mentality when, like, someone's on really high percent and then they get a stop off on you? Like, even though you, you should... Oh, my God. Yeah. Seriously. <laughs> The force. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. Right. He probably thought he had no more stocks left, if I'm being honest. Yeah. And like, this game is like a write-off at this point for Scrattles. Like, the only way he'd win this is if he um, pretty much exclusively goes for Shines. And yeah. And that's one thing that... I feel like Fox Mates actually... Uh, oh my goodness. I feel like Fox Mates don't just, like, brutally shine Falcon. Well, like, just brutally shine some characters. He gets so fucked for it. Oh! <laughs> An opportunity for Scrattles to bring this to a 3-1. Yeah. Caleb needs to hold onto this lead uh, for his twenty life. <laughs> and he gets caught rolling away. Stuck underneath this platform. This is a dire situation for him. Oh, is he going to get the, the mutual knee? Oh. That was such a clutch knee to find because he got it off the late hit of the net and he reacted so well. Yeah, That's going to be it, it though. Two, two, two. Oh, the quick reset. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it would be so funny if we just ran it. <laughs> yeah, it would have been just take so it, take fun. It. Two two. Yeah. I am going to Pokemon though. Oh no! I hate this stage so much. We should just play Poke Floats instead. <laughs> Poke Floats is garbage. 
but at least it's not RNG. A reminder, this is Frozen Stadium. Yeah, it is. I like this way more. This, this, I seriously love this. I hate the little lip on the ledge there. Yeah, that yeah. really annoys me. The transformations just add too much BS to, to try and play around. Yeah. And like, it's, the only reason why uh, Pokemon is probably stuck around as long as it has is because of this neutral transformation, right? Yeah. If it was, if it always transformed, it would have been. If it was like green greens and then the other transformations, people would be like, fuck that, we're not playing that so no. Make FOT even count kind of here. And like, yeah. there's an argument to be made that like, it's Fox propaganda that the stage is still in the, in the rotation. <laughs> it's in Fox it's, propaganda. In, it, in its like, transformation form, you know? Like I don't think uh, I don't think most other players except Fox players actually. Uh, <laughs> I, I hate it so. Much. Fox can do so much goofy shit on this stage. He's got infinites for soon yeah, transformations. Yeah, a lot out. of them. And, and we're just like, yeah, but but wobbling's the problem. Yeah, well, <laughs> wobbling is a problem. But, but you know, prob but, but you know, wobbling's the problem, not the problem. But this shit boils my blood seeing this kind of like Fox getting Ooh. infinite. That's it, it doesn't work on the floaties though. So yeah. yeah, but like, still. Ooh, good job. Straddles is looking really strong this game, but he's also like possibly gonna like die here. If 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 he gets the Caleb stuff. Oh, just fumbles the wave dash a little bit. Nice. You see how much one knee from the ledge like gives you stage control? Yeah, insane edge by the way. Alright, this is Straddle's chance to Nice, the fucking hell. How many? No I think he's, he's probably hit more techs than he's missed on that thing. Yeah, no. It, it is. Kale's it's getting so consistent. very survivable. Yeah, and he needs to. This is also a big moment for him, because like, it's probably like, uh, the closest he's been to really getting some PR people. Mm. Uh, it's just up to him to really kind of like hold this stage and just uh, force Straddles into shield so he can get a yeah. I mean, he's doing it, really good at that so far, but he's not making any call outs. If Straddles nice, wants to, oh, no, it's not. Nice. It's too high. No. It wasn't too high for well, him, he, he just did a double, double jump, jump too quick. Yeah. yeah. Huh. Caleb, oh. committing to neutral now. Oh, see. But the Nez is just so strong. Yeah, this is what I was talking to Muscat about before. Brave has got a way of like bringing people across the stage. Yeah. And that's especially against someone like Falcon, who really doesn't have a way to deal with it. He's got nothing. And then he I just gets Yeah, just absolutely. See? Oh my god, what's yeah. this combo? <laughs> that's a quick 56% for Straddles, and he's got Caleb in the corner. Quick roll in for him, he's gonna reset, but Caleb just lost a lot, lost a lot of momentum with that combo. Yeah. I like Still, it's a game. This is. Oh That's it. All right. Uh, not bad. Not a bad show. Good job. Honestly. That was fun. That was, was good a fun. fun. Yeah, it's a really fun. I enjoyed one. watching that one. Uh, Hawaii SSBM, thank you for rating with a party of 13. Welcome everyone to the stream. Uh, welcome to South Australia, where we finally have offline tournaments again. It's fantastic. Yeah, thank you everyone for showing up. Uh, we got another losers quarters, I think. Yeah, yeah. We have the other losers quarters coming up. Thanks for all the followers, guys. Spam us. Metallic, Hawaii SB SBM. Cholo Soccer Mom. Stepio, what's up everyone? Show some love for all these people who are stopping by. Dover SSBM, Soggy Cuticles, Pixel Jacket. I'm just going to keep rattling them off. We don't, we don't have Metallic like... Metallic 99 Frost. We don't have like notifications on the, um, the stream broadcast because it kind of detracts a little bit. Yeah, it's like hard to follow. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So I'll just read them out as they, they come through. Yeah. So who Pixel Jacket and Firefly. What's up? Lemons we got and Flowey. And now. So this is the other side of Losers Quarters. Shout out to everyone coming through. The Union Jack gain is <laughs> looking strong in here. Love you all. Alright, so yeah, Flare Rats versus Lemons up next. The Big Cheese versus a lemon. Versus <laughs> a single lemon. It, this, is, this is like the lemon cheesecake matchup, you know? <laughs> uh, this, yeah. Have you ever had like Vanilla Galliano and... Um, yeah, I'm good, man. Uh, have you ever had like Ready? Vanilla Galliano and... Um, and, um, what's it? Lemon squash. For, for the Americans out there, our um, lemon squash is your lemonade. Ah, wait, yeah. is there, they really, there's like, it's like jelly and jam. Kind of difference. Yeah, like yeah, kind of. Yeah. So our them. lemon squash is their lemonade, right? And our lemonade is just Sprite. Really? Yeah, yeah, our ah. lemonade is just Sprite. Uh, because it's like, technically lemonade here is, um, is still lemon and lime, mm. right? But, uh, lemon squash is all lemon. And that's the American. Right. 
So Flareon's you like on new? the green fox, by the way. And yes, Dover, uh, IRL tourneys. Yeah, it's never crazy. see it. So uh, Adelaide, that's the capital city of South Australia. Um, we, I don't think we have any active cases. We do not. I don't no think we have any active one. cases. Um, we literally have been clean for a good while, and restrictions have been easing up quite a lot. And so, uh, as long as we're following the guidelines that SA South Australia Health is providing for us, uh, we can we can continue to run offline tournaments again. It's and really we appreciate good. your coming to watch. Yeah, it's fantastic yeah. to have good interest. It is awesome here. Yeah, New Zealand is like at zero as well. It's, um, like the Southern Hemisphere is gonna start popping off for Smash content again, which is really cool to see. Yeah. Um, Australia's yeah. kind of the same. I, I'm praying for everyone in America. Like all my American game, all my American like, friends over there. I really started to. Um, yeah, I, I really hope everything um, clears up sooner rather than later. For out there. <laughs> yeah, the West Coast, food. East Coast, and oh. Southern Hemisphere man. 7k tourists came to NZ. Jeez. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's uh, that's the truth, Firefly. That's the truth. Other but. countries do trust their leaders and experts. <laughs> it's crazy. You would have seen it coming. Yeah, we're not. Actually, that was a good clip. <laughs> that was a good clip. Um, I'm just going to completely ignore this game because I think Florette's has this in the bag. But, like, uh, there's a good clip of somebody trying to challenge the. Uh, oh, the double jab? Let's go, Lemons. Sam is bringing up the Coriolis effect in The Simpsons. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh, Hawaii reopened to tourists. Yeah. Oh. I see. Insane DI by Flareds, by the way. He, he DI'd the shine up so he landed on stage. Mm. Anyway, uh, so there was a... Um, de yeah, so it was the Deputy Prime Minister of New Zealand was being challenged at a press conference by someone being like, oh, can you prove that, like, by, like, these four, like, points that, like, coronavirus is even real? Like, I'm just asking questions. Like, I just want you to, like... Prove to me that it's real, and then the literal deputy prime minister of New Zealand is just like, it's like, now, now, like yeah, you can sit down. down. You can children. sit. You can sit down, actually, um, uh, because you know, like this, this. You must have got your education in America, because that's what he said. Like the literal deputy prime minister of New Zealand was challenging this guy in a press conference, saying, "Oh, you must have been educated in, uh, in America." And um, here we have, you know, he's just he's saying just the facts, and he's like, and he's like, yeah, two hundred thousand cases in America. Um, and then here's this guy who comes up and says the Earth is flat. I love that New Zealand is very no nonsense with its conspiracies. No, I'm allowing this message auto mod. I'm allowing that. <laughs> Add permitted term. Fuck America, indeed. Who just won that? Surely Flowey did. Flowey did win. Yeah, he was close about. though. He was close. He went down to last stop. I mean, he was on like a hundred. Lemons can definitely get a game. Yeah. yeah, absolutely. Oh, good DI. Sick DI. I've been playing against so much of Flowey's Fox. Really? Yeah. I was, and like, I was, oh, yeah, playing as well. I get to play the shape. Oh, yeah. He thought. He was actually like, just slightly too early. Like, yeah. probably like, I want to say like, eight frames too early. <laughs> I don't think up to really confirms into up smash for Fox like that. How do I play the Mario game? Oh, what's up, Q Hat? Q Hat's a Q Hat's like an FPS player. Oh. The Mario game is hard. Yeah. Trust, trust us. You get carpal tunnel syndrome. <laughs> you probably get just as bad from other like computer games. From being yeah. Crazy. Well, the thing is with melee, you just kind of have to death death the controller. So no, you don't. That's the that's the bad. That's yeah. the worst advice ever. <laughs> that's, that's the, the only way you can play well. <laughs> Right. Thank you, boy. Hit toggle yeah. up. All right, man. We'll do. I'm gonna give your account a follow as well. Thanks for stopping by, and I appreciate the raid a lot. Yeah. Thanks for popping in. Why can't I just follow you? Yeah, that's You know, my hands hurt more playing Jiggly Fox than you playing Fox. I like hold my controller so tight because I'm like, if I miss one bit of tech, I'm gonna look like an idiot. Ooh, here's the thing though, you should really be training to let your hands be relaxed. Yeah, I know. It's like, like, like it's actually so hard to be conscious of like 
stress in your body. Yeah. It's actually so hard because you're just like trying to focus on what's in front of you. You're not like yeah. feeling yourself essentially. Yeah, there's like a like every once in a while you see one of those like Instagram posts or oh, yeah. Instagram sort of things. It's like just let your shoulders drop and you're like, yeah whatever and then you do it and you're like my shoulders were like tense in yeah, the day. Yeah, yeah, it's <laughs> fun. <laughs> you had no idea. I feel like claw grip on mouse is worse than holding a juice. There's a claw grip on mouse? Yeah, oh, yeah, I imagine, like this, yeah. Like this, because yeah. Of the oh, yeah, that's the way that I do it, but it doesn't yeah. hurt. It just depends on the mouse, honestly. Yeah. Because this one's good for claw, because it. Anyway, 10. <laughs> um, <laughs> anyway. I think the claw grip on mouse Ooh. is better than the mouse. Oh, that. Oh! Stop. <laughs> uh, Florets is kind of clutch god. Yeah. That's one thing you actually can't count him out on. It's like he knows how to close things. Mm. That's really handy. He's gonna need it for this last game. God, see, you can tell I'm not a fox man because like when I see an up throw at the ledge, I'm not thinking about the punish. I'm thinking up throw double shot, double shine you off stage. Like, <laughs> ain't ain't about that that punish game bullshit. Clean stock from Flurats though. Yeah, FD is such like a. If somebody was dominating you before, they're gonna like yeah, they're push gonna your shit pretty in hard. on FD. And then, oh, wish we could, yeah, there it is. <gasps> Did the up the down tilt the wrong way? Yeah. I'd like to see Lemons just move around a little bit more, you know? Yeah. I think um, Flowrats doesn't particularly move around heaps, but I think there's a big weakness in the Australian uh, melee meta. It's just like, we all don't want to play neutral. We don't want to be in neutral for like oh, more than a second. Dude, I love playing neutral. I like to just get a lead yeah, and run away. Yeah, but that's because when you land a hit, you don't get a second hit. Yeah, it is true. Unless you it's get one hit and that's your hit. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You're just looking for the grab. Yeah. Well, a lot here of you the... go. Ooh. Lemons had something going there, but he just dropped it at the last minute. I'm not sure about these up airs because they're not quite working. Out. Pretty good. Yeah, honestly. All things considered. Oh, just good decisions to do those short hop fights. That was such a good. That yeah, was really clean. I love how like the that up smash like sent you the wrong way, like the weak <laughs> hit. Good punish again. Nice. You love this one. Yeah, this, this pick is, is what it pays for. This pick is actually working out, and Thorat yeah. hasn't had the good DI on. This. <laughs> yep. Yep. <laughs> Great job, guys. Great job, guys. <laughs> that was that gonna work? <laughs> that was just funny. As well. Oh. This is the wackiest fuck set I've seen. <laughs> I love doing uh, that shit. Somebody just like scared of coming, like playing neutral. Like. Adelaide's kind of the oh, yeah. home of the shit fox. <laughs> oh! The up angled F still almost was a setup. <laughs> Would you put that on, Come on. shirts? Adelaide home in the shit fox. Okay, real shit. Uh, we, we, honest to God, <laughs> would do brackets. Just called like the shit fox bracket. Like it was only available to enter for oh. people who don't main fox. <laughs> and so we ran it at like a few major after parties, and um, everyone's like drunk and shit, right? So yeah. it's even worse, but it's so fucking funny to watch two foxes who don't know how to like punish, down, what they come throw. up with what? to like punish. Oh no, lemons! Oh no, lemons! Not like this! Dude, he's still alive! He's, he's living. living! He's living! Oh. He just he has to live a little longer. Yes, a little, a little. Oh my shit. Oh, I'm, I'm so surprised both these guys. Look at this DBZ right here. Oh! Yeah. My god. Oh, this is a jab. Oh! Here we go. Don't this whip is, it. It's all or nothing for Flavor. <laughs> yeah. Dude, if they go back to FD after this. Come on, Lemons. Just, just some no. neutral. No. Just some. Oh! Get the shine out of shield was all yours there. If you got a shine out of shield, you would have sent him off stage. And that's the other thing about it. Uh, there it non -fox is. Non-Fox mains. <laughs> like, where's the shine out of shield? That is, it, it feels really foreign for any character. <gasps> oh, oh, decision from <gasps> Chloe! <gasps> the ledge dash is actually going to keep him in this. Oh, no. oh, oh. come on, just grab that. Oh, it's all coming apart. <laughs> Lemon's just uh, precise enough with his neutral right now. And it's all... Oh, oh, dude. <laughs> One more hit and... If Florence gets an up smash, it's over. <laughs> Whoa. Come on, come on. No! That was all yours, but a 3-0 for uh, Florence. Do it. 
Yeah, it literally should have ended ten times by now. What's up, Sock? <laughs> Alright, so losers uh, semis? semis is going to be happening after Loses winners semis. finals, which is uh, me and Musket now. Alright. Alright, winners finals, so your boy is stepping up. This is the old Musketator. Alright, wish me luck, fam. Alright, I think gonna... I know how to work this. Yeah, you get, got a pretty good, idea, pretty good idea. Yeah. So these are your two in games, and then these are all your out of games. Right. Yeah. Yeah. I'll just right. check. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. All right. All right. Play stream. This should be a fun match. This is a match as old as time. I think the last time these guys played in tournament, Kai just barely took it for grand final. So you've got a good match coming. How's everybody's day going? We, I think we have some people from, uh, from America in here. Kai's gonna... We'll see. They, I, I, I don't know if they played before before the tourney. Uh, Ruben is not here. I don't know where he is. I, I haven't seen him for a while, but no, Ruben is not. I love watching these things, right? It's always fun. It's like the battle of the, the two deck places. And both of them have been grinding on their play, because they're sure most people have a back. So, and this is the first time they've played a tournament for a, a while. They may have played on Friday? Uh, Alright. What stage do you think they're going to go to? I'm betting like Battlefield or Dreamland. I think they go Dreamland more often. It's just more fun for the stage, but certainly not like FD or Yoshi. Yeah, Dreamland probs. That's it, yeah. Good call. Let's get some uh, Fox perspective. Yes, sir. There's a lot of uh, Fox perspective. Let's see. Yeah. Just the shade pressure's a lot. Really quick first shot coming in from Kai. He's just playing neutral in center stage. He's not really going to be fun. Like, nice. Yeah, the down air was definitely a good shot. Trying to uh, play power in spots when he's like coming up towards you. It's like just beat it out of down air a little bit. There's so much pressure. Really clean stuff. Just that first stop is like kind of just a dead end. Nice. That's a good point. That is a really good point. The, the laser game is so underappreciated. I think, I'm not sure about Australia wide, but like at least in, say like Victoria, South Australia, people just don't do it enough. Because it is so strong, and it's such a pain to do it. Just while you're busy and kicking around, Fox is getting like 40% of the feet, so I can get neutral there. Must get making the equilibrium a lot better. Okay. Yeah, it's stuck against Kai, but Luke has pull combos. See, I, I think they're working because they're playing on center stage so much, so there's, there's no way for him to deal with it. And even if they, yeah, see, as soon as they go on platform, he has the option to tap on the stage. The platform is so good. It's not what it's
to anybody's game now. Oh, <laughs> I love those combos, the Shine Bear. It does so much damage. I don't really appreciate it. That's it. Good job. That was a strong first game. Wonder where they're gonna go. Next. Yeah. I mean, it's the first stream tournament for a while, so I'm nerves are really setting me. I played like dog shit. Probably because I am garbage, but also the nerves. This is an understanding. It's less stream. Jeez, man. If you hit that. that laser. It's always fun to see if you can get out of the so. Nice! What? <laughs> that dash dance shield from back here was clean. Did not expect it. Yeah, no, he's like trying to get the armada up airs for like the uh, huge full hot airs and they're just getting like, stuffed out. He's playing platform so well. He's just not spending time on the ground so must get to come to him. from the ledge. Yamada up there. <laughs> that was ridiculous. That overextension for one. Yeah. You're right dude. Kai has to run. Must get in Kai too. It's always, over like the past six months or so, people have just been experimenting with this stuff. They're broken as, yeah. We take coming from Fox, but I, I, I'd be inclined to believe that. That's just gonna end. Nah, no, it doesn't make the conversion into a full set of That was good to your eyes though, but it's yeah, getting off the platform as soon as possible so we could get the whole fighter. Oh! Overextended the grab. Dad, this is dangerous. Oh, the rogue. The rogue forwards are just coming out. Just slamming the shit out of Fox. Good shit. Two out of Kaiser. Now they're going to FD. That makes perfect sense. Oh, I'm again, this is, uh, yeah. <laughs> this is what it is. Chain grabs galore. Just makes quick work. He gets so much damage off. Him. But then again, the pillar combos. I don't know. Yeah, you're right. It is a, a very poor as a kind of pick on this matchup. I like the way the Kai's moving today. 
Ya. Oh, no, you can't. You just have to wait until you come down. Okay. Maybe it should work. Yeah, here we go. Yeah, must get you swifting. Chain drive. It's costing me a lot. This is the original chain drive. Yeah. He's living. Good DI. Yeah. Good DI. <laughs> Nice, no arms to take this time. Match is Eve. Yeah, you could, you could see it, but I guess the, the tape just wasn't out. The AS See, this is, this is why this counter kick is like, once Fox gets shit going and ruins Falcon or Nancy, yeah, and now it's back to the neutral part. That, that, like, 130%, like, up, it just melted the fuck out. Yeah. Alright, Kai's taking a deep breath. Playing on the ledge while you're a uh, stop down spell against Fox on FD must be nerve wracking. Yeah. Oh, it's really good for that. That's such a good tag. That's a huge tag. Must get trying to kill Kai instead of just getting damaged. Yeah. Who knows, if this goes to game 5, it's going to be really intense. But Kai's definitely still in the right there. Yeah, he's just spacing out with back here, trying to keep him on the ledge. But as soon as he gets back to the same stage, it's hard to try and pull him. Oh, but he's always even a good start. Alright. That was almost scary. 
Yeah, it should. Get looks on face by it. Nice karma collected. Still going in. Nice. Now it's back. Yeah, you gotta take him. I mean, this is a pretty tense set, and I think they're probably really likely to meet. At least. Here we go. This might actually go to game five. Oh, the invincibility on the side beat coming in. He's playing on the ledge. We saw this before, how Muscat likes to play with Kai's going to be not where he is after he caught on on that FD game. Oh. <laughs> he got the laser. The laser reset. I'm surprised it wasn't an FD game. I bet he didn't even think it was going to be That's it. Wow. Are we looking at a reverse? Or are we just going to get straight into it? This is a really sweet set. 2-0 to 2-2. Musket's really kicking it in. He's picked it up. He's back on the stride. Ready? That's on to that but I think it's in a good stage this thing. Yeah, he's getting caught by this one. Let's go. Yeah, that's a shame. It's a still super easy game. All it takes is one straight back air while he's in the ability. I like getting into the zone. <laughs> Look at him go. Just a little hip hop. Listen to some uh, uh, copyright free music. Hotel Chin by Kevin McLeod. Sweet <laughs> elevator music. Yeah, no, this is what uh, Muscat was trying to get in the first two games. All of these straight up there, but I was beating them in four hot days. Listening to the lottery playlist. Is that a thing? I'm sure it is. It's pretty straight. That really blew up, huh? Stays on the ledge. Yeah, sweep him. How's he gonna get back though? The shine still probably yeah, that saved him there. See the more options you have against the uh, recovery of this box, even if they're not as good, it just kinda makes them worse. When you gain five, the stress is kind of getting to you, so you're just going for cheese when when you're recovering. I think that's a lot of special Alright, I was getting in the zone. Deep breaths, stay on the picture quite fast. That's it. He doesn't need much to close this out, but neither does Muscat. Muscat looks like he's probably gonna play for damage this stock. That's his nice favorite mark. Oh, he's not gonna kill. The mad one. Oh. That's looking like it. Good stuff to both of them. That was fantastic. Alright. Um, do you know who's up next? Good stuff. <laughs> yeah. Good stuff, Muscat. 
Alright, we have Scraddles versus Flow Rats now. That was a good cool start. Now we're hitting two foxes. Uh, Flo is a, famously a uh, chic player that's just been grinding foxes. And it's a really weird kind of fox. So you like, play fox like somebody else would play, uh, play chic. And so it makes it fun to play against. But, I mean, Brad Straddles is probably the most fun fox to play against. He does really goofy shit all the time. in a bit. See how this game pans out. Uh, Scrabble's got such a. Oh, they both got pretty weird boxes. I'd say, uh. Yeah. <laughs> uh that's where you don't want to happen. When Yoshi's on first game as well. That's a power play. <laughs> There's a... It, whoever made Fox's face is strong. He's a monster. <laughs> you see him walking? We were talking about this before the tournament started. How much like walking is like the middle ground of movement? Like, I know that sounds really dumb, but like... I know, walking changes, like, if you try and implement it, like, walking on platforms, instead of just dashing, like, it gives you more just what you otherwise. It's really good for strikes. Yeah, Brad, <laughs> Brad whips his head. <laughs> they look like they're having fun. You love to see it. <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> Alright, come on, this play. Ready? Go! Really clean. Flo 
so. Alright, is that better? Alright, this is, uh, it's pretty close. <laughs> I, I just don't want to blow people's ears, so. Lose semis, good point. Yeah, I did fuck that up. Yeah, I, th I think Brad really hit his stride there. Then. Getting back into it, getting his confidence back. He did SD on that first stop, which is it's always a huge hit to the to your confidence when you SD on a tournament. It really stings. Like I can deal with the last stop SD, but not a first stop SD because that just fucks up the rest of your game. Look at that, man. The shield, I, this is something that's kind of new, like shield pressuring from, uh, from below, like hitting with those up airs. Because usually I just expect like a shield drop, or that the shield drop is to shine. Yeah, he read that grab, got him with a cheeky little combo. Nice job. He's playing a lot for you now. He's close to the first game. Wow. That's, that was a punish and a half. Since when did Fox is starting to start doing up airs? Like all the time. Like for any punish. Oh, yeah. <laughs> if it didn't get it out. It's like a, a hidden boss in uh, New York. I think his name's Aqua. And he does this thing on FOD where I think it's called like the Dingo Drop or something. Where you run up to like the ledge and then you turn around and shield on like the same frame and like very close to each other. You just snap the ledge and it oh, instantly. Wow, good shine. I love watching Brad, man. He's very... Like... He's not super fast, but he's still reasonably fast. Yeah. And he has just, um, he's, he's very good at punishing horizontally. That's always cool. Yeah. People love, like... He's good. 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 And also, Mango's such a personality. Yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Mango's laugh is, like... Grain into the back of my head. It sounds like someone's scraping like a like an already clean plate. It's like it's like um, oh, yeah. Well, he's incredible. You know, so he, he he's warranted that look, yeah. look, look, it's it's you know. You should never should talk someone's laugh because you know at the end of the day them laughing, them smiling, it's a yeah, exactly. know, it's a beautiful good, thing. Good for Mango. It's good for him. Yeah. Alright, got the back throw. Oh no. Oh I really I really thought he was gonna get hit by the Jack was looking for there. cheese, but at the end he got Oh yeah, he got me down. That was a really good answer. Yeah. They played this stage earlier and like uh Brad 
SD'd at the start of the match. And like, I was, I was talking about like how SD'ing at the start of the match is way worse than SD'ing at the end. Because like, it fucks your time mentality out. Like, for the rest of the match. Is, is this top 8? It is. I mean, we only had about 10 Yeah, this is a with. small, this is a small tournament, so <laughs> a lot of these, um, a lot of these games... Well, actually, I mean, well, Sam, yeah, a lot of the, um... Of the top topic, which really just means everyone made top eight. Well, no, everyone, but a lot of people made top eight. A lot of people are winners, and that's what matters. You know, everyone gets to go home feeling like they achieved something. Even if they went one and two, they're like, "Well, I made top eight in yeah. this SA tournament." Oh. Uh, All right, now he. But Flo's put up such a fight. Like for a Sheik player, like he is. Oh, he's been playing, you know, playing Fox for a bit now. Yeah, um, it's not bad for our first, like, streamed IRL tournament in quite a while. I think yeah. the turnout is, like, it's pretty appealing. The thing is, it's like, it's gonna take a bit of time getting people. Base for a Yeah. It's gonna take a bit of time getting people, you know, coming back. Also, this was a very late notice. Yeah, Honestly, super like, late notice. I found out this happening shout out last to, night. Yeah, <laughs> shout out to the people that, like, actually showed up because, like, yeah. It was, I think the announcement came out like Saturday. Yeah. About this. Um, Super late. But like, oh yeah, hey guys, yeah, no, we're actually running Melee for DC because we're like splitting up to. Um, Good job. Splitting the weeks because to reduce like the attendance in the rooms. Uh, oh, okay, nice. Well. Good job but, to Brad. He's he he stumbled a bit on the first game, but. All right. Well, Jack's still Jack's looking like he's in high spirits. So, well, I didn't. Yeah. Always. Who is playing uh, now? Kai now. This is Loser's Finals. Yes, Loser's Finals. Now we have... We're not doing venue. No. Oh, yeah, I took, I took, I, we're doing entry. Oh. Like, as in, like, tournament, yeah, yeah. we're not doing venue, so that's yeah. why I took everyone's five dollars, but not everyone's ten dollars. Yeah. <laughs> See, where it's right. gonna, you know... The first hit's free. Plus, you know. <laughs> first, <laughs> first, first hit of the melee is free. First hit of the. Yeah, well, no, well, you just have to pay for them. Oh, I mean, you don't have to pay for You know, some people pick out late. Some people are playing the melee without having to pay. Yeah. Bailey's going up. He's giving. Oh, well, well, he's giving oh. the, the free, free game, so free Dude, set coaching. The coaching. <laughs> the secret. Shh, shh, shh. Oh, he should I change the score. Yeah. Yeah. We're good. Alright, this is going to be great to watch. we got Q hat. Q hat, yeah. Oh, uh, yeah, we're good to go. Oh. Um, you're not in frame. You're not in, you're not, yeah. Wait, click on here and I'll scoot him over. Yep. Um. A little bit to the left. It's Wait, fine. No, I'll, I'll just scoot you over. Yeah, yeah. yeah you're fine. <laughs> we'll move you. I was, only, I was like, wait. Yeah. So, There we are. Perfectly centered. It was all good. It was all good. Should be. Yeah. We are. Uh, we got raided earlier. Uh, it's like, yeah, like almost 30 people. That's nice. Yeah. yeah. It was awesome. Which set did they raid? Uh, pardon? Which? Uh, do you know which set they raided? Like which set? Um, it was. I think. I think it was like Kale versus. Kale versus Brad. Brad. Yeah. Well, can't win them all. <laughs> what? That was an incredible, that was a good set? Right. incredibly fun set to watch. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like um. Anyway, I'll, yeah, I'll, I'll finish that boy. I'll we'll move on. <laughs> we'll move on um, so, admittedly, last uh, one winners to go that wolf Brad. Um, yeah. It go poorly in the sense that like the games weren't very one sided. Just like. He was just getting one or two stock each time, right? Yeah. It was like, a lot of most of the time, like, he was just getting one stock. And, and I remember my set against Kai, like, first two games I was getting, like, one stock. If that, like, game three hadn't gone my way, it would be the exact same thing. So, like, these, you know, it can turn very quickly. Well, yeah. Hopefully, Brad, no, 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 no. Ooh, ooh. All right, on three, come on. No, they're doing some, they're doing some. Alright, they day. figured out how to up yeah. this first <laughs> yeah. stage of, you know. It's always, because some people go scissors, paper, rock, and then some people go like rock, paper, scissors, and some people go one, when two, When it comes three. to RPS, I'm like, I put so little, I'm just like, yeah, one, two, for and then I just do my thing. It's like... Yeah. Most people are just like, you want to start on Battlefield? Yeah, you start on Battlefield. Ew, I hate, I hate starting on Battlefield. What? 
So I can see. That's it. No, Kai and I have actually solved no fear times. Mm. And honestly, there's been, there's been times where I've won. There's been times where he's won. Like this is. Oh no. So he got back through S smash. Um, it looked like he was even not SDIing at all. Oh. He was SDIing now. But when you get back thrown like that, you can SDI up and you can just get out. You put yourself in a much better situation. You're getting back thrown near the ledge. Yeah. You just want to like SDI like mash up. Sort of. There's like a. Oh, that's it. If he can. Jeez. Yeah, Jeez. that was good. Yeah. Oh, is he making it back? Oh. So a, lot of, a lot of foxes in that stage, um, in that like situation, would grab the and then try to do a like drop down back air. But you don't need to. You can just like. Yeah, sure. Yeah, no, you can just like yeah, you can just like jump off, you know, and just do a um double jump air and yeah. close it out immediately, rather than try and risk the blood mix up on like yeah. Yeah, Brad's big on consistency. It's like. Wow, raw man. Okay, he got out of the um, invincibility. He... Alright, yeah. yeah. One, here comes Lee. <laughs> yeah. But he's, no, he's actually, he's actually shorted them and wave dashing out shield really quickly. Like, yeah. that's the thing, he's mixing up. He's not just staying in one spot, he's not just getting stuck in shield. That makes it a lot more iffy for the Falcon to actually approach. That's it, he's in the corner now. And he's... Great shot. Oh. He plays super lame. I'm surprised he went to FD. You want to play like you want to play flame, but you don't want to give up like you don't. Well, you want to play defense, but you don't want to give up too much space. You just don't want to just yeah. like give up space for the sake of giving up space. There it goes, and it's gone. Yeah, yeah. No, he's still he's still got 76, but this is yeah, yeah. Stock oh, okay. He went for now. I wonder if Bear would have um hit because if Bear hits probably close to that stock. That's smart because a lot of Falcos will be able to do like. The, Double shine pressure, but it's not actual safe shine. Like it's that West Ball shine shield pressure where like yeah. they wave land after the second shine, and that's when you can. Push. How's West Ball been doing? I haven't seen anything. Not He's uh. Yeah. Well, look, we won't talk about that. We won't talk. About oh, we won't talk about, we won't talk about that. Look, dude, I'm so out of the loop. He's um. I just don't care about the personalities. I like the game. Okay. Yeah. Like I like when people are entertaining in Smash, but people have like such a good game. Oh, it's a fucking children's party down here. Pardon? It's a children's party. <laughs> <down here. laughs> I don't think your pride should be derived from like, doing this. Well, just like shitting well, on people. You should have pride in like the sense of like well, you're doing something well. Like, at, as the game, I can see, not, like, the, not the ego. I think you should have like pride. You should look down on people. Yeah. There's a difference between like being pride, like being proud of like. Oh, there it is. That straight back air really sends him off. Alright. Yeah, you can be proud of yourself at, about being at the expense of others, you know? Yeah. Dreamly? Do you think? Uh, Battlefield. Battle 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 I feel like this is, yeah, this is definitely Kai's Twitch account pick against me. Mm. I know for myself, I don't. I hate Battlefield a lot because um, <laughs> you can't mix up the um, angles from below. That's one thing yeah, I really. Yeah, that's true. I really it's like that. Hit and move yeah, you, you just have to. You're forced to kind of like. You're forced into very specific spots once you're below stage. Whereas, like, even on, like, say, FOD, or, um, you know, like, oh, no. oh, does the Decca game 5 or so? On, um, FOD, you can still ride the wall. Yeah. That's a pretty big, oh, I think he was, I had no idea if Brad was actually meaning to go straight there, or if he was trying to do the slight downwards angle, and he just fucked up. But that's a really hard angle to do. Yeah, see, like, it's... Those lasers were so clean. Like they yeah. hit him on every little run on his way down. And, and you see, he gets below stage at that point. He just has to cover um, the fox going to ledge immediately. And fox can only do that angle and go straight up. If fox goes straight up, and you just punish afterwards, mm. like as he's coming down. Yeah. It's hard. And arguably, he's. Oh, oh yeah, he, that's it. That's yeah, it. Yeah, there's nothing you can do. I feel like though. he could have just held ledge, but that works well. Yeah. Okay, goes for the, like doesn't want to go for the wow. slightly more. Dude, Kai's moving on this platform. The dude's making it real difficult for Fred. Yeah. Oh, that was. That's that's, that's it. Oh, yeah. that was towards the end of it. That was almost like the, the Sakurai angle. Like, Basically, that's another spot where, like, Fox had very few options. Yeah. Right? Like, if it was, say, Yoshi's, he could have gone, like, much sharper, like, horizontally instead of, like, that sort of move. He could have just not get hit, but, like, yeah. I mean, it's yeah. really hard to do. <laughs> he's, he's been dying, but then he's been, like, immediately striking back. These. 
this is a very big sock because it is going 2 0 up is huge. Admittedly, the counter picks in this. Um, <gasps> oh my oh. goodness! See how he, <laughs> he just jumps to that platform? Get, yeah, he's just. No, oh, the pillar combo's coming in. Oh, look at this! Getting oh. pillar comboed when you're like up. That was so way. risky. Yeah. He slowly <laughs> yeah. walked behind Falco while he was on shield. Like Falco could have <gasps> oh, oh, oh. oh no! <laughs> no! He was. I was convinced that Brad was jumping. I was convinced that Brad was jumping. <laughs> Everybody Brad was. Had every, Brad had the. You the scream, nerve to I not scream. jump to just stay there. We I would have one hundred percent jumped in there. I would be like, yeah, be like, ah, you know, that was a little mix up. Look, Brad's just Ready? hands in hoodie. Yeah, like yeah he's, he's so calm, so confident. I don't mind. <laughs> cool, calm, <laughs> but it's me after that sort of game. I'm just like, you know, just taking a big deep <laughs> breath in and like, all right, like a big wheezy sigh. <laughs> and he's, oh, Ooh, what the? Is that a power chair? Wait, what? I thought... Nah, couldn't have been. Wait, you mean the um, counter? Yeah. He he's got, just saying shit. Yeah, like he got sent left... <laughs> he got sent left of the down smash because he was a bit slow. Because basically, like, Falco side B, Falco, um, moves, and then the, um, Phantasm hitbox is behind him afterwards. Yeah. So you can get in a position where, like, Falco's already in front of you, but the Phantasm hasn't hit you yet. So you hit him, but you didn't hit him when he was behind you, you yeah. hit him when he was in front of you. So you, even though you didn't get hit, you still hit him and he's, like, Goes the other direction. It's not like ideal. But. Cheeky up smash from Brad, pushing out the first stock, and you see how he's playing center stage just to get the chain grabs. It's really clever. And then he carries. Oh, that was stage. a big dash that was huge. attack. That's, get, that's I think that's it. Yeah. Well, he, oh, he's living. Yeah, that was a huge conversion. See how he Brad always does that. He's doing the switch and just like carries people across the stage. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, his like edge guarding in this set has been reasonably solid as well. So yeah. If he's carrying people across and then hitting the edge guards, like that's really cool. now he's at center stage again. See, the Fox gains so much from being center stage on battlefield. He's just playing. He chain grab. Oh, these. Are, okay, I gotta say these up smashes are very, <laughs> yeah. They're a little bit. Um, but he's weaving in and out. He's just not getting. He's just so hard. To oh, get. You see oh that? that shine! Was, did you see that shine? <laughs> that shine was insane. That he was like nutty. snuck under with yeah. a he snuck under a fight that shield and then just that. What? Where? Where was this? Well, oh, this is. I'm actually really shocked. This is someone bringing air from ten, bro. That was nuts. Still, this is by no means over. Yeah. This is like, well, whoa, 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 this is. It's only one plus combo and SD, and uh, another SD away. <laughs> he's catching. He's catching high out with these grabs. Yeah. He's just not baiting. Like he's not falling. Okay, with well, they. See, that's. You can't go for that there. You can't go for that like full hop style there. What he was doing before, he was just keep maintaining center and just waiting. Oh, this is, that was a bad shine by Kai. Was, yeah. Oh. All right. Well. Oh, that's it. Wow. Wow. Good stuff. Damn, I'm playing Brad. I was yeah. very much expecting to play Kai. You're not expecting it. All right. Have fun. Yeah, no, it has pick up on the head on there, so just leave it on the chair. Yeah. Yeah, it was starting to get like... <laughs> sound like a mosquito. Let's go. Whew. Alright. <laughs> that that H-Box emote is obscene. Yuck. Hello. I don't like how these feel on my head. Don't no, tell Kai I said that. <laughs> yeah, he'll uh, Kai, beat you I, I, no, Kai, I appreciate your setup and you're cool and good. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we've got Scrandle versus Muscat. Scrandle? Yeah. Scrandle. See? Scrandle. Scr <laughs> yeah, oh, it's right there. Yeah, yeah see, on. I told you. Look at this emote. How I, obnoxious no, is that? I hate that game. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Look, I'm already back, so I'm not going to start timing people out, but... <laughs> Alright, this is Grand Finals. You know, I don't remember, I, was, I haven't been to EVAC in so long, but last time, hey Campbell, last time I played the games here, Scrabbles beat Muscat. Uh, I thought someone was yelling at me. Scrabbles, yeah, Scrabbles beat Muscat. Yeah. It was actually kind of insane, I was so happy for him, but also that was like seven months ago. Yeah. I, and like, Muscat definitely plays Netplay, and Brad definitely has played it twice. 
Yeah, no, I played it once, and we were like relishing over the fact that like uh, all it takes is your computer to be like, oh, you're you're at like 55 FPS, and like fuck this game's fucking unplayable. Yeah, it's gonna we can't play yeah. this shit. Anymore. Which is funny because I'll play like I'll play another FPS and like, or, like I'll play anything at like shitty. <laughs> shitty frames yeah, but melee is the yeah, melee is. I'm like uh, 59 FPS. But also, fuck out of here. I already don't have fun playing this game, <laughs> <laughs> so to make it less enjoyable, yeah. Um, miss you too, Campbell. Can't wait to see you when I don't know y your your state gets good as good. Yeah. Time out, Geordie Pog. All right, that was bye, Geordie. <laughs> don't be fucking late. <laughs> uh, I'm. How do I? I can't screen control. Timeout and let's go. There we go. Pog, Pog, he's gone. <laughs> MSJ's gone, boys. For ten minutes. Is this an in-person tourney? Yeah, it's because oh we're in SA, bro. Goodness. Oh, lady. Yeah, it's the I'm best. I'm all inclusive, or whoever you want to be. Are they? They're not playing the game. And also, they're we need not. to make this zero zero, not yeah. two zero. Dude, what are you, what are you up to? Up. Just get off my ass, bro. Yes, yeah, SA is very lucky. Very lucky. What do you mean lucky? We we just have a uh, good health standards. Yeah. You know? Not this filthy Victorian. Yeah, no. yuck! You gross. <laughs> Melbourne. Yeah. Yuck. <laughs> true, true. But we do have rusty water, so they do blame us for that every time they do. Apparently, people don't wear. We do not. Wear we don't masks. wear masks in SA because we have had zero cases for weeks and weeks. Probably for like a month now. Oh, uh, we. I think we had like. A uh, couple that we kicked out almost immediately, but yeah, we haven't worn masks probably months. Yeah, a long time. I hate wearing them, not because like I can't breathe or anything like that. It's just fog up my glasses. Oh, I look like a fucking idiot. I, like, I, I'm a nurse, so I wear them anyways to work. But uh, I can understand not wanting to wear them. Okay, so Brad getting owned real quick. <laughs> oh, but it's okay because Brad's about to. Yes, yeah, Brad. Brad does that to me every single time we play friendly, so I will never take it, probably. <laughs> he's, he's like the most fun yeah. Fox player in the Cool. Yeah, he I does. love Brad. He, I, Bradley! You watched it. Okay, he, he, heard <laughs> he heard me. I feel bad. <laughs> oh, he's fine! Shush, 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 shush. Oh, the muskies heard me as well, though. Yeah, they're both smiling. They're crap. They're holding it in, though. I'm a bad commentator. <laughs> I'm going to stop being so loud. Yeah, that's probably um, This is a ASMR commentary. I really hope. I really hope Brad gets this stock because I actually feel kind of bad. I fucked up his punish. I fucked up his punish. I made fun of him. Get him, Brad. Sora. I actually blame Sora. Sora. Sora's best man. No. I'm gonna scoot him over a little bit. Look at him. Look at the little man dancing. <laughs> oh yeah. I forgot last tournament when I was doing that. I was yeah. making them all wide. And shit. Yeah, it was really funny. <laughs> Just like zoom in really yeah, hard. Yeah, oh, yeah. I was like sweating from how fucking <laughs> strange yeah. you, you zoomed in on the sweat yeah. needs on yeah. his face. And then he, he saw I got angry. <laughs> I didn't think he got angry. Oh, maybe. I, I think it was all in good fun. I think Scrandy is about to actually take this stuff right now. Scrambles. He's just Scrambles. gonna keep winning little neutral hits. Scrambles versus out. Because this punish is ridiculous. Right now. No one's doing it. Oh, oh, never mind. I lied. I lied. I lied. <gasps> that little never mind. I didn't lie. <laughs> I'm faithful. Oh, yeah. I, I don't know what to tell people. <laughs> I really don't. <laughs> Flabbergasted, even. I am flying. Look at that waiting. That's called patience. I don't really? like when people have patience. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Black uh, is in this season. Uh, I've never seen Muscat not wear that in my life. He's looking at me and hearing me. But everyone's wearing. It's uh, a. And to cool, be fair, well. Brad owns th three separate pairs of clothes. So three separate pairs. Yeah. What, is he fucking rich or something? Uh, look, <laughs> I, I'm. I told Brad I'm gonna go shopping with him soon, but I just bought nerd clothes. So nerd clothes. Yeah, yeah. Clothes like yeah. I'm I, a gamer. He, he probably can't trust me. Like, like those, uh, like those trucker shirts, it's like. Of course I don't come. I want to truck a hat. The cross hat. Yeah. <laughs> it's just like, there are three things that God fears. Devils, uh, serial killers, and truckies. Yeah. I, you get I, it, and there's like a big skull on it with flames coming out yeah. of it. Yeah. I, I get those on my wish.com. Yeah. <laughs> the, the I don't have wish, but just the Facebook wish ads. Yeah. No, they're really, they're like personalized, but also not at all. Yeah. Because, well, I get a lot of sus things on my wish.com. Yeah. And I, like, I... I don't even use that computer for anything other than schoolwork and Facebook. So. Schoolwork and Facebook. Yeah. Other than that, it, it uh, 
It's like a really old laptop, so it doesn't have any power. I should really... I haven't even looked at the game. Yeah. Um, I don't know. Look at this. Big, uh, right. Oh, right out of the lead. Right out of the lead. <laughs> yeah. Why am I not cheering my boy? It's because I jumped in my Yeah, you, you kind of screamed and might close. have thrown him a bit off. Okay, you remember how I said Brad had a lead? It's just like, oh, never mind. What? I was going to say it's diminishing by the second. Like, no, it's, it's still winning. It's still winning. It really is. He's winning. It's, 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 it's winning. He's won. No, he's GG. We can. The Brad wins the game soon. In a, we can do that right now. I, uh, <laughs> yeah, um, no, but it's not Grand Finals yet. I did it Grand Finals because Kai said that I messed up the camera. <laughs> there we are. I think Kai just said it was always going to happen. There we go. Every time That's Brad takes a stop, I'll make him do it. You don't get that from old <laughs> the okay. And if, if, if he wins, we'll, uh, we'll zoom in on Musk. Nah, I'm never zooming. I'm zooming out on Musk. I need my boy Brad. Oh no. There is. You know what? No, let's go. This is equal really rise, small. equal fights. Oh, no, no, Brad, stop, bro. Stop, Brad's huge right now. <laughs> he needs it. He needs it. He's up a stock. Brad winning, smiley face. <laughs> yes. Dude, I would fucking hate to watch this. <laughs> it's like big it over. You guys got melee over there? <laughs> you, you guys play ultimate or melee? Brad's winning. Look at him. Nah, He's moving. I'm not gonna do my Look at that. I'm not doing Musky like that. Let's right. put Musky back to normal. Yeah. Alright, change the score. Yeah, I'll change the score. It's one on. <laughs> Bing bang bang. Ready? Go! So Brad, get oh, Ethan. Oh, oh no, that's a that's a tiny Brad button. Hey, do you want to be part of the survey that have asked people with a code commentator? Well, commentator with survey? You? Yeah. No, I don't do surveys. You don't do surveys? Well, I, I'm gonna let you collect data about me. No. What the fuck, dude? It's a melee survey. <laughs> Definitely not that. <laughs> <laughs> do you think I'm gonna let you know my melee tricks? Yeah, your melee tricks. Yeah, yeah. Sometimes I've got so many of them. Like uh, spot dodge. <laughs> yeah, I uh, and then I go for charm. Damn it. Roll in under pressure. That's yeah. me. <laughs> <laughs> it must be so hard to concentrate uh, when you're talking about. Yeah, I know it is hard to concentrate. There's so many things to think about. Yeah, like uh, Brad's Brad's face. mouth. But he goes you know what? Even yeah. Musk has a beautiful face. Look at him. The, these are determined gamers. These are two people I appreciate and respect. So the SA community. Yeah. I call him in my like mustache. Okay. Like I'm gonna need you to stop you right there. I don't want to hear that in my life. <laughs> Yeah, this is the way the SA rolls. I feel like the way that uh, Muscat and Brad play this is pretty different. I feel like the way Muscat plays it is more right on FD, but I mean, I'm a bad Falco player, so who am I to say that's right? But it's Muscat's definitely more uh, punish orientated uh, through grab on FD. Brad's, uh, Whereas Brad just kind of does the yeah. good hits on he, me, but he like he carries people across the stage. I think there's a reason. Uh, Let's get to that too. Oh, oh, die here. Oh, He's about to die here. Bam. Yeah! Woo! Must have been hate me so much. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. All right. That's that's, that's fair. That's fair. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's good. good. It's yeah. good, man. <laughs> Love that for me. Ah, woo! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, I don't, no, I don't want to hear that. It sounded like a. Uh, My, um. You know, what's his. The guy that voices Buzz Lightyear from Home Improvement? Oh, Tim Allen. Tim Allen, yeah, you know, he does like that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's my real I don't want to turn this into a Tim Allen broad stream. You know what it's like to be going Have you seen the Oblivion bed? video? <laughs> Where it's every sound in Oblivion replaced with Tim Allen broad? <laughs> <laughs> it's such an obnoxious fucking voice. <laughs> That's my ringtone, and whenever I hear that shit, no, I'm that going, should not be a ringtone. Yeah, no, whenever I hear it go off at 3 in the morning, it scares the fuck out of me. <laughs> <laughs> just like drifting off to bed. He's <laughs> okay, you can just <laughs> we're playing the game off there. We're, we're doing Tim Allen grind. Ah, <laughs> oh, fuck it up. Oh, my, oh no, Brad's not. Moving right now. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> Brad's not moving. Yes. No, I think this no. is. This I don't know As a fox, I really, really love when Dapper Cat just converts into up smash like that. 
But when I'm any other character, I'm like, wow, really? You have all these moves that converted to up smash and you're dash attacking. You're yeah, like, cool. It's kind of disrespectful. Like, it's, it's so disrespectful. It's like the reason I use rollout all the time. Is that big Do you win, though? Yeah. Really? It's, yeah, it's fun. Alright. Yeah, sure. You, you do it like once a match, <laughs> and someone thinks you're gonna recover. Like when people are sitting on. Yeah, I, I, I feel like you've even done that to me. It's fun. I love it. I remember you used to roll out recover all the time. I, like, uh, I, I don't think this is good. Nah, it is the best. Nobody expects it. I didn't realize that when he's flying off of the screen, did you see his tag like shake? Does it really? It's gross. I never knew that. I feel like uh, part of the model, I guess. Do you read uh, Japanese? I do like. Uh, I don't, but I can ask Brad to translate it in between a few times. Yeah, I don't think it's a good idea. I think it's this one. I think it's gonna be like Daisu or something like that. Daisu. Oof. Yeah, it's actually the Japanese equivalent of Scrambles. Yeah, actually, sometimes he does do. Yeah. He does a bunch of just like. Haha, oh. <laughs> uh -huh, this makes this sound. What do you think is more tilting to play against? Crown puff or like headband puff? Headband puff. Yeah. <laughs> but like, okay, no, because everybody does crown puff is like, yeah, I'm the cool puff. No, I'm they're the like, I saw Mango, he did that thing where he yeah. read Armada's roll as kid. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, no, no, no. But um, that's tilting because I'm like, oh, they think they're an Omega Chad, bro. But you've seen crown puff? But at the same time, I use crown puff. Yeah, so no. I have to I have to say H-box puff. Yeah, no, I, I always use headband puff. Yeah, good. That, that shit's funny. <laughs> it's kind of funny. It looks really cool too. Yeah, yeah. I, I will actually say it's one of the coolest skins. It's just that it, in it's my head it's not cool. Yeah. And I, I think like the fact that this game has like a physics yeah. engine for like the chain. I do and like flower puff. Flower puff. No, I, well, I used to rock red on every one of my characters. So I used to use flower puff. For every Here we go. Dude, we got a game. Yeah. We, no, we we like got, no, not a game. We've got a game puff. five. We've got a game five on our hands right we now. We have. You don't like blue puff? Yeah, blue puff's kind of like the black shape. I don't know what blue puff is. I've never seen it in my life. It's got the, it's like the blue little flag. You know? It's like a no, the red one. Or whatever the fuck it is. Oh, 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 oh. Let's go, Randy. Oh, that's that. That might be the only. That might be the only truth coming out. He gets it. Does he convert? Oh, Brad. This is always hard to watch. Blue has a bow. Yeah. Like a little bow. Oh, it does. That's oh, that's oh. it. GG's, guys. A really well fought, well concentrated for all the distractions we gave. Look at, yeah. the, look at the friends. They're talking now. Yeah. They're best of buds. No, I, I sure. Known each other sure forever. If they got up and he shirt fronted him. And then, that was the tournament. Tournament winner? You didn't win. Yeah. <laughs> Right. Right, who are we? Brad, do you know who? Oh, well, I don't want to ask you because you, you're a loser. But do you know who we have le next? <laughs> <laughs> who we have next? Oh, After it's Grand me. Finals, it is you. Hi, Mom. <laughs> are you. <pr> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, told you. Nobody would have known. He's asked me to. I want to get. You gotta get my time in the camera. Yeah, you gotta get your, mo your money shot right there. Yeah. That's gonna be on like your IMDb. You now people get all those cheesy photos for IMTPs. No. You don't? Oh, did Brad get smackaroos for coming third? <laughs> Why are you getting more money? <laughs> Wait, you got second? That was grand finals. <laughs> <laughs> that's why he's that's why he, when he got off the stage he said that's the tournament. Oh I thought he no, I thought he just said that's tournament winner because oh, okay, that makes sense. I didn't real. <laughs> that's so funny. I didn't even know. I thought that was like losers because I thought Brad was a loser. Wait, then who who beat Kai? <laughs> 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 you beat Kai? I thought you got owned. Oh. Yes. What? I'm I'm fucking oblivious. Dude, man. how fucking checked out are you? It says. Look, I came from a party, man. It I don't says, know what to tell you. Grand yeah. finals. You think I've ever read anything in my life? It's written I'm like there. Floyd Mayweather. <laughs> hey, there, was, there was a whole couple beers. The little boys should get a drink. Em. The big boys up here. <laughs> I, I, am I the closer now? Am I the closing act? Uh, I think you are. You have to leave uh, leave us with like a joke or a strong mark. Leave us wanting um, more. Thanks for watching, guys. This is a fun tournament. Okay, I said this to Brad and Muscat earlier. A Muscat was beating up a computer bot before himself. 
uh, with no one around him today. Beating up a computer bot. Yeah, like a c CPU. Like, right. like a level one CPU on the bot yeah. instead of playing other people today. And he... Uh, he got off the setup and he was like, I just beat me today, nobody can beat me. <laughs> and I was like, Muscat, if you punch yourself and it hurts, are you strong or weak? <laughs> <laughs> that's a fucking. That's a fantastic. Like I feel like metaphor. that's what that was. So yeah. if anyone beat him today, he he was weak because he was beating himself. Yeah. But if he beat everyone today, must get strong. <laughs> he was telling me how he was bouldering the other day, and he was like, "Yeah, did a couple things." Yeah, like I had like, like everybody a couple on my back. Like, was just like holding Who cares? three fingers. Although then I heard Omega Chad SA Nick Omega did, did one of the hardest bouldering things there was today. Uh, not today. <laughs> recently, I think Friday, and he did it with one hand. One hand. Yeah, so it's it's kind of funny that in in bouldering he still has the hierarchy, like Nick's still above everyone else here significantly. Anywhere he goes, he's Even just like he's at the top of the food chain. Yeah, well, uh, at least in those SA. two aspects. Yeah, <laughs> which pretty much bouldering and melee, which to those guys is a it's is, is a lot. It's yeah. a lot. That, that's not a yeah. I'm not gonna. <laughs> yeah. So how do you like the wisdom, Zara? I mean, you won't get that in Victoria. <laughs> well, I've gathered that Moscow is huge. Look at him. He, he is huge. He's like, what, seven he's like, foot five, something like that? <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> no, he's like five, eight, nine, ten. No, he's five, like, ten, like maybe? seven, two. Oh, yeah. yeah, right. No, he's like giant. Must Twi get uh, Twitch height jokes. Don't get around him. What? Twitch? What'd you say? You know, every stream is short. Every Tyler short. One's short. Yeah. Ludwig's well, short. Well, T1's Everyone's also short. built like a brick. Yeah, well, like that's what they have to make. So that's it's like, like a bowl short. Compensatory, <laughs> yeah. 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 No, he's got the head dent. It's hilarious. <laughs> he really does. It, like, fits his head. We are not closing up this stream. We are not. Do you I guess we're just talking. Yeah. At least until, There are a bunch like, of gamers. I don't know if Kai likes me touching his shit. Look at them. They're all just Look gaming. It's Will Down Smash, Kai, Kai, Kai Will D, Caleb. Oh, fuck. It's all wobbly now. Lemons is here. Lemons did lemon Hello. things. He lost a Euro in Tekken. Lemons, tell me how you're feeling. He says, I'm feeling okay. I don't... I, really I played Tekken, Tekken like three times. Yeah. I'm not a Tekken gamer either, man. <laughs> yeah, that happens. Tekken that kind down. of... That game has too many moves, man. It's got a lot of them. It's like a hundred or some shit. Those yeah. fighting gamers... There's 200 of them over there. Fucking Divided no. by... 10. Divide, so, there's 20. Yeah, there's 20 Tekken gamers over there. Jesus. Which is still way, way more, more than, than Melee. Yeah. It's we've got like... Why does Melee get the short end of the stick? I know. We're, we're so cool and good. Yeah, Maybe we it's are. because I keep telling everyone we're so cool and good. Yeah, they're like, like, yeah, good one, away. man. I'll get play fucking ultimate. Yeah. I'll get two combos and pop off. That's, but that's what you do in Melee, man. No, I know. You get like <laughs> 10 combos and pop off. <laughs> I, get I, do I do that in Melee. <laughs> I, I get an up throw rest and I pop off. Yeah, that's that's kind of funny. It is. It's like a, you're, like a caricature. Yeah. If you do an up throw rest and you pop off nowadays, it's like... It's like paying homage. It's paying homage. I like to do the H-box. I like to do whenever I lose. I like grab my fucking controller. Fucking fuck! fuck. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that's the iconic. Go fucking like that. Fuck. Or like I beat the shit out of the CRT. <laughs> I hope it's your own CRT. <laughs> These things are gold, liquid gold over here. Solid gold. gold. Yeah. No, they, dude, there's loads of them where I'm from, but... Yes. I it's I had like a fuck city. off amount of them in my suburb, yeah. but I only ever brought one here because I don't know, I'm lazy. Yeah. I, well, I, I can't bring them down, man. They'd yeah, because you're in Broken here. I am. Right, Fuck, yeah. man. It's hard to, like, bring shit to him back, let alone, like, a piece, uh, CRT. Mm. But... Mm. Oh, Wise man, words. What a good tournament. That was fun. Good tournament. For the first tournament I actually, in so long. I, I will say, I really, really appreciated this tournament. Yeah. I just didn't know it was Grand Finals. Yeah. And I feel like I, I was gonna... Uh, no, I wouldn't. I was gonna say I would have commentated, like, more professionally if it was, I knew it was Grand Finals, but I really wouldn't have. Yeah. I just probably wouldn't have told... Talked about their clothes as loudly as I did. Yeah. Well, you can always read the computer and see what set they're playing. Yeah. What are you fucking crazy, dude? Get your head out of here. <laughs> all, right, all, right. all right. Yeah. Cool, read. Cool guy. Cool guy. Yeah. No. They said you need to be more nonchalant to be cool. So you just sort of have to like be really stoic and not that's give a fuck so about sad. anything. Sad dude. Sad dude is dead. Yeah, he that, died. That he is, overdosed. You yeah, think that's cool? He died He's with nonchalant. All the other vine stuff. Huh? It died with all the other vine jokes. Well, he did. He, but he died literally. Yeah, Asadu like, died like right after Asadu became popular. Really? Yeah, you he reckon? just overdosed and died. <laughs> what did he uh, this probably should be a graphic yeah. graphic stream. Now. No, I'm pretty sure Kai's stream is mature. 
surely. Fuck, 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 <laughs> fuck, fuck, <laughs> fuck. Right, now, now, now it's mature. Yeah, if it wasn't bad before, Jesus. Mm. I don't think sure. there's any children watching. Oh yeah. no, the numbers just dropped heaps. Dude, what did you do? <laughs> I actually did. What did you do? Oh you no. Saw, like five viewers. Jeff Bezos has just censored us. <laughs> Jeff Bezos, like, get this off my screen. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> this, this little troggy kid. <laughs> Jeff Bezos has fucking had enough. Yeah, it's me. <laughs> me and Jeff would not get along in the same room. We probably would. Probably because I'm like, just like trying to milk that like therapeutic economic relationship. Even if it's just, hey, I met you. Remember when I met you? Yeah, remember that time that like I said hi? Jeff would stare me down. I, I, it'd be like a... Can like, you imagine Jeff Bezos just like pulling his shirt off? Like, what the fuck is up, baby? You ever seen those like medical Look mannequins that have the eyes that like blink and they like... <laughs> Oh, yeah. dude. I feel like that that's video. what Jeff Bezos is. He just came to life. <laughs> there was that video on Twitter of like that dental robot that like started malfunctioning. Oh, yes. and just got <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. I've seen that. <sighs> that was funny. horrifying. Yeah, it was, it was pretty funny. It's, it, it was awesome. Yeah. Like, it's like some good like shit to help you not sleep at night, but it's really yeah. cool looking. Yeah. He must have... What the fuck? Sinker fans? They're, they're throwing... Uh, synonyms out here pretending like yeah we're just some belligerent ghouls <laughs> there you go there's my we belligerent. are just, we are but fools to the twitch chat yeah you, you guys are mean, so man. literate i can't even read i told you, you can, yeah that is a good point so i mean twitch chat has kind of lost all of its charm at that point right hey twitch chat <laughs> i got you now i got you now twitch chat <laughs> who's the smart one now <laughs> you're a massive suck up yeah. isn't that just like a kiss ass sick for me yeah it, you could have just said suck up, Like man. a bootlicker? He probably does, man. Like, he, uh, he's so rich that people can afford to, like, do whatever they want to just... Because, like, if a million dollars went missing, he, he, like, wouldn't notice it. Yeah, well, no, he's literally one of the only people in the world that's not going to notice... Notice a million like, dollars. Even was. those people that have, like, are billionaires, they're still, like, going to notice, even if it's not significant yeah. well, at all. that's how they got to be billionaires in the first place. Exactly, right? But, but I feel like Bezos, you could literally just rob him, uh, like... Rob him blind. $50 million, and he wouldn't realize it. Yeah, and that like sets you and your kids up and your kids' kids up for life. Yeah. And then there's Jeff. You know Jeff Bezos could like give like everybody in Africa like a hundred bucks? Yeah, but giving everyone in Africa a hundred bucks would do nothing. Yeah, I know, but he could do that. Yeah, he could. <laughs> yeah. True, <laughs> he could true, do a lot of true. things that probably aren't worth there are, it. There are a lot of good things that a lot of rich people could do. I'll, I'll leave it at that. I will. What are the other angles we got going on here? What are they? That empty chairs... It's a smaller one. I like this one. Yeah. Yeah, this Woo! is the boys. This is good. I knew, I, I knew there was a, a better boys one. Oh, don't do that. Do you have to do like... Oh, I'm gonna, <laughs> there's a big screen here as well, just for <laughs> us. To Jeff? Just for us. Why is there two Js? Tell me. Why is there two Js? I don't know, man. That's just how I am. It's like Fortnite Jeff? Is what the, the fuck is that? Fortnite Jeff was like... You know when... uh Net, What's the... Rollback. Rollback Netplay. Rollback, Rollback Netplay came out and everyone had funny... Alt names and stuff. Funny like, alt names. Really? Like people, people alias? No, just Jeff. J-J-E-F. Yeah, it's the most I, misspelled I, way of spelling Jeff. One it? F, two J's. I was I was like considering like chucking an G I in there. Jeff. Yeah. I was thinking about, well, I was thinking about this this morning when you have money, money. It's not about being, it's about owning money. I mean. It's about okay. printing business. Geoff. Goff. Yeah. Geoffrey. Yeah, you know how fucked jail is that it's spelled like Gale. Gale. Yeah, but it's not anywhere else. Yeah. You know, that's like an SA colloquial thing, isn't it? Really? I'm pretty sure I it didn't is. Know it was an oh, SA maybe colloquial. it's Australian. I think it's Australian. Yeah, probably then. Yeah. But yeah, jail. I hate it. Yeah. Okay, Gale. It's, yeah. Obviously like that. Australian. For some reason, they thought that was a good idea just to confuse us simpletons. It's like a lot of weirdly spelled words. Old timey English thing. Yeah, that's why it's because th th they don't. Do they do Gale in? England, they they wouldn't now. No, probably not. But if you go they to Adelaide, the slammer, the old yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the slam house. Uh, <laughs> yeah, no, jails in Adelaide are called like G A like, Gales. Yeah, they're well, because we have boomer jails. Let your hair down, Jeff. Uh, no, nah, dude, it's pretty long. Do it. <laughs> no, it's like greasy ass, long and oily. Yeah, yeah, dude, I bet. My hair's like I can tell. Yeah, it's okay. You. Let it go, <laughs> man. <laughs> my hair's like. Super thick. I've got like Greek jeans in me that make my hair fucking like Damn. frizz up. Yeah, dude, it stinks. And I've got a headset on, man. So you have to tune in for the next tournament. 
Are you going to let it rock next tournament? Yeah, I'll let you it rock. You have to now. I'll let it rock next tournament. Please. If, if Q hat is there, how curly is your hair? Pretty. It's like wavy. <laughs> what the fuck with the lips he's after? I'm sorry, man. It's banning this guy. <laughs> yeah, time. He can't say let your hair down and then WTF you. Dude, I agreed to do it. Just, no, don't ban, don't ban, don't ban, don't ban. <laughs> don't just leave. <laughs> guy's gonna get angry. He's never gonna let me commentate again. <sighs> My hair's just—it's not—it's not, it's not uh, curly. It's like kind of wavy. I'm not an emote anymore. How sad is that? Really? I used to be an emote. The Lord Pog, or whatever the fuck yeah. it was. Yeah. Lord Champ. Lord Champ. <laughs> I um. I couldn't afford to stay a Kai sub, and it's clearly changed now. Yeah. I think it's a big cheese. Which I, I to be honest, I get around. Yeah, I'm uh, I'm I'm pretty. Like, this tournament, I heard about it last night. Like we're doing a tournament, like on uh, Sunday at three or whatever. Yeah, same. I just it's heard like, about it last it's, night. It's fucking well. Saturday night. I'm like, uh, oh, yeah, yeah. I'll come anyway. You know, yeah. I've got nothing better to well, do. Well, I, I I literally was like going to a, like a family birthday. Yeah. And then I was like, you know what? Fuck it. I'm just gonna go play melee. And yeah. then half of the boys that said they were gonna come didn't come, and I was like, cool. Yeah. That's really cool. It's classic melee stuff. This mm. melee shit, man. Mm. That Caleb that guy has sick he hair. He has fucking curly hair. He does. It, it used to be way longer. He's he's trimmed it back. Yeah, but it, it, it's it's real curly. Could have like hit it hit it in the cloak. Yeah. Sometimes I like I see people. These commentators have nice teeth. Thanks. Yeah, I know. I get complimented on my teeth a lot. Really? Yeah. I never. I, I Dude, just get complimented a lot, man. Yeah, you do. Especially by Twitch chat when they said I wasn't cool enough or whatever. I liked <laughs> that. <laughs> that didn't hurt at all. I'm not going to think about that later. Thanks, Twitch chatter. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> You're fucking like s s screaming in the shower, like rocking back and forth. Yeah. Nah. Oh, cool. <laughs> nah, that, that person balanced it out with nice teeth. <laughs> yeah, it's... Caleb... I Sometimes I see people with... <laughs> sometimes I see people uh, like walking anywhere and they have like really long curly hair. I'm like, did I just fucking like run into Caleb? And it's like, it's just like some girl with like really <laughs> long curly hair. Like, that's fucking not Caleb. Um, when I first came to I'm just dumb that, everybody knows it I'm, I, like, I, I'm just dumb I thought when I first came to Melee jeez oh, you're you. right your I'm fucking phone is Tim Allen Grunt that, right. that was the point no that wasn't the point when I first started playing Melee my I thought they, I couldn't not that I couldn't tell the difference between Catherine and Caleb, but it's when he had way longer hair as well. Yeah. And it was just, it was the same person in my head. I, th I reckon if Caleb, like, wore it was like a, a shadow clone. And hunched down a little bit. Maybe. Because Caleb's, like, really lanky. So, like, if you just, like, put on a beanie and, like, hunched over a little bit. True. Next to Catherine, you couldn't tell. You could not tell. You, I told you, I man. I mean, you could, but nah. I, I couldn't. Nah. I, I told you my, my ringtone was... Yeah, I know. Uh, I'm, <laughs> that's horrible. I, dude, I never lie. I'm, like, the truth. Are truth you the truth? Tim. I'm truthful, Tim Allen. When are we closing this out? We've been like talking. We've for been talking like nothing. Yeah, we've literally. If there's it's like there's a, there's eleven. There was nine people listening before. There's eleven people <laughs> listening now. <laughs> they to went up us after talk. you fucking cussed out the audience. <laughs> yeah. yeah, after I Jeff Bezos us, you, you all just like talking. Yes, that's why we're yeah. on the comment. What, that is. Why do you think we're on the commentary why, thing right now? Like attention. Yeah, and like, like the spotlight on me. <laughs> like talking to someone. Like. Feel, being felt like I'm being listened to. Yeah, that's why that's, it hurt when the people start leaving. It's like that's it's why I'm gonna stop cussing out Kai's stream. Listen, if we can't do a podcast because there's too many podcasts, I didn't like that. Is. Did you see the um, "Don't Start a Podcast" like celebrity? Oh, was that thing? a college humor video? Or? It might have been. I don't know, but it was just like the most like you're gonna say that from your like. Your Ho holy yeah. grail of you, you were doing exactly what yeah. Throne, yeah yeah doing exactly what you're saying not to do like cool cool good like cool it's, dude yeah they like cool gook. <laughs> it's Ooh. it's really hard to take anything celebrity say seriously did you see the uh, the Imagine John <laughs> 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 I was about to say the Imagine John <laughs> that was the that most had me crying obnoxious thing. And, and, I, I I was watching that at like two a.m. Yeah. Like, sobbing my eyes I think it's the funniest shit it's ever. It's fucking ridiculous because they're just like <laughs> we're all in this together. Yeah. I'm just in a mansion yeah. and you're in a studio apartment. I, I watched the NBA and I love I love like the NBA like watching basketball. Yeah. But when they were, were like we have to quarantine in Florida in their mega mansions with like <laughs> yeah. their own chefs. <laughs> <and> <laughs> 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 It's kind of hard to. They can't do it with while they're getting paid hundreds of millions of dollars. Yeah, it's like, yeah, like yeah, it's really kind of hard to you know feel bad for you. There's guys. a really good twist on that Imagine thing that I saw on Twitter where was it's it Jack films like doing the Smash Mouth version. No, no, it was a, uh, it was, 
some guy was just like, I just didn't get the memo, and he was just going like, he, he was doing Stan by Eminem. Oh my in god! In between the cut, it was really I don't know. Dude, I'll, I'll, I'll show you some other time. Yeah, dude, they're up. Hello, Muska. Muska, are you letting us free now? Can we end the stream? Because we've just been talking about nothing. No, no. What we, we're shirt pretending. is we're that pretending other guy wearing? We don't want to end it. Which one? Dude, you should big words. Bailey? You're wearing Man. a Neon Genesis yeah. Evangelion shirt, right? Yeah, that's... uh. That's Ray. Yeah. I got it the other day because I was like, looks kind of retro. Looks like something I wouldn't wear at all. And that's why I want to wear it. Because I want to wear a nerd shirt. Where are the commentator things? <sighs> uh, no, I'm not going to AFCON. Is COVID over in Australia? Is COVID over? That in our a, state. Yeah, yes. just about. We haven't We've had, had case zero cases for months. Ages. So we're doing IRL tournaments back. It'll be a little while in uh, Victoria. And like, but pretty yeah. much everywhere's good. Jesus, dude. All right, I'm going to take this call. Yeah, you take right, a call. You thanks, gotta, stream, you for watching. It's have been a great. Down, uh, I'm heading off now. So uh, take care, guys. Follow Jeff at where Jeff is. Follow. Don't follow me, man. Yeah, please don't. It's not worth it. It's right, really see not. See ya. There you go. Wow, that's lucky. Once again, not lucky. Not we just, we handed it well. See, we some, some people are going to say that the best part about winning the tournament is the pride. Some people are going to say the best part about winning the tournament is the 60%. But you know what it is? It's talking to me after it's, winning yeah, the tournament. Yeah, it's getting tournament. the winners into and seeing this man's happy, yeah, smiling face. I know, I know it is. It's like, <laughs> look, look, look. You came a little bit late, but it's okay. I you, did. You, you did some commentary near the end. Probably hindered Brad a little bit more than it helped, but that's okay. Look, he got second. He did, no, I couldn't yeah. let him get first. Couldn't let him get first. I could not let him get first. Too much ego. Too much, too much ego. Too Brad much. would have never lived it down. Oh. Especially oh. after I was like, last time I saw you guys play, Brad won. That was a long time ago. That, yeah, no, you're right. It was yeah, a long yeah. time ago, but last time I saw you guys play, Brad won. And Brad Weedy. was looking like, oh, like oh. It, the Yoshi's was so spaghetti at the end oh, there. Oh, it was terrible. But it was looking like he could have taken that. Then yeah, I was like, oh my god, Brad, to reset at least. I was like, I was that's saying, I was, I was saying to myself, I'll go game five. Wait, I haven't, I haven't got a thing. Also, he beat Kai. That, that, was a free, that was a very... I didn't even know. Brad, Brad told me he beat Kai after. I was like, yeah, shut up. It was a free and it was like... It game was free, free was not very... Yeah, game free was... Look, Kai was... I was talking to Brad about this. Like, look, you know, okay. When you beat someone, it's the classic, like... Um, even if they're not actually playing bad, you're still like, yeah, no, they're playing a bit bad. You know, you try and be like humble, you know, that sort of thing. Like, yeah, you know. Uh, you but no, what about when, when you you just beat me at when we were hung over or whatever, and then yeah. I was like, yeah, you played bad yeah, after it, you beat me or something like that. Dude, no, I, I took a game. Yeah. I took the first game, dude, I, and I, I was I, like, dude, you're playing so bad. No, no, dude, I I, I, I remember <laughs> the situation actually. It was like, you were like. It's a, you, you win the game. Oh, you yes, it's you're okay. Like, you're like, it's okay, man. Just very shame. And like, this wasn't even like insincere. This was like I felt bad. Yeah, I yeah, felt yeah. bad for beating you like, in melee. It was like you like this, this shouldn't be melee. happening. Yeah, it shouldn't. shouldn't. And that's it's like that breaks the hierarchy. It's like when you see, it when you see when you, it's like you see like <laughs> you're the stable parent. They're they're hung over. You see the stable parent, and they're like, oh, it was, it was concerning. And it's like to see Musky losing to me. Um, you don't like to. That was a very sketchy pull, actually, and like. Two ones. All. I was, <laughs> I was very close to um, coming first actually. Yeah. Funny enough, I um, but I was also very close to just not making out of pools. That would have been. I remember uh, McLeod being afterwards being like, um, yeah. If 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 you if you didn't make it out of pools, I would have like never. I would have given you so much shit. <laughs> it was like I don't know. It was like poor. If like, you had a loss to me to not make it out of pools, that would have been even worse. That would have been way worse. That would, yeah. Way way um, worse. Look, you, night four, you know, you sit down, you have a drink, you're like, oh, I'll have one. You yeah. Know, oh, you know, like, you sit there, you're talking to the boys, you know, you, can, you can't just have one and then just talk. Everyone else is drinking. Yeah, and then you you're know. you're drinking out of a boot. <laughs> then by you're, 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 you're in the look, BAM, the BAM look, after party God, bathroom God. and everyone's going, musky, no, no, no. musky, and oh, you're drinking oh. out of an entire hey, boot. Look, 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 post, <laughs> that, that, that's post, that's post oh, entire jug out of a it's boot. It was kind of incredible. That was post taunt. I remember, I remember like seeing Alpha, I was like, I was definitely just like, oh, I was there. Mascot, Muscat won the tournament, but almost drowned in pools. No, not this one. No, this one. Like, different big he did not win Big Cheese. Not no, even close. No, no. He's a loser. Like the rest of us. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, no, you're right. Yeah, <laughs> I, I, I mean, yeah see, I threw myself under the bus last second there. I was going to be like, hey, I'm in a pool. Hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, no. yeah. Who won our set? I, uh, I made top eight, but I also wasn't happy with Did you like, make top eight? Yeah, I made top eight, but I lost the Ruben that tournament. I was like, oh. Hey, look, number eight in Australia. <laughs> hey, look. You're not wrong. No, yeah. he's, he's got. Although he'll, he'll never get seated as number eight in Australia. No. He's gotten some really good results, actually, online. He, he seems to just consistently get... I play him in friendlies, and then I ask him to play serious, and he, sure, he bops me, but then I watch him play good players, and he wins, and I'm like, all right, okay. But then I watched EVAC happen, and I'm like, okay, Muskie. Okay, no, look, look, he, 
and Kai. He turns it on. Fun. He turns it on when it you know when it matters. And that's what you know. That yeah. I'd rather. I'd I, rather I, I would yeah. I would rather. Everyone would rather be able to do that. Yeah. Than um, to, yeah, he's been getting some good results online. McLeod's been getting some good results online. McLeod, McLeod beat Sock, was it? Or beat Socks uh, in winners. He beats Mopop as well. That was oh, a very iffy set. Oh. I played McLeod recently on that play. Yeah, yeah. I thought I was going to get. This is an M rated stream, so I thought I was going to get fucked. But you did well? You did well? I think he was playing bad because, from what Ruben says, McLeod's significantly a lot better now. Yes, no, he is. He's very. He uh, yeah. Is. Um, and uh, it's not like. I feel like he, he won 60% of the games, mm. which I feel like. He's out of my skill tier now. But yeah. So I, I'm, I'm accepting. I heard it. you were playing um, Falco uh, under Will D's tag on. Who, who told you that? <laughs> who told Will you D. that? Because I, I, I have a, I have a um, similar related story. That Caleb, was I know, I know, I, I know about the Caleb. Oh, the story Caleb that was well. very funny. Yeah, For that those of you who don't know, um, so Kev came to my house, played some net play, um, had like stayed logged in, logged in on his like tag, whatever. I log in, he hadn't switched it back. I was like, ah, oh, fuck, I'll just play some Falcon. On the, on the Caleb tag, I run into Kalen. Yeah, you play some friendlies. Um, look, he. Oh, I will just say I won. I won them more significantly. More. You can well, say no, it. no. He was he was you, actually winning. You mopped them. They were going back and forth at the start. Then, like yeah. I would say, I started winning. A you bit adapted. More. I won. I won. Um, you outthunk. I got very, brain Kalen. I got very lucky. Got um, FD in the last two games. And um, just won those two. Just quit out afterwards. And um, then Caleb goes and yeah, just goes types GGs. GGs. Gets no GGs back. I'm like, damn. Oh. Yeah. I never get a GG's back when yeah. I'm actually me. Well, it's fine. When I'm oh. Will D, I get GG's. Big big props from Decker. De yeah. I, I he beat Decker I in a fair few games, and then he was like, wow, Will D's really got a scary Falco. I was like, <laughs> yes, he does. Yeah. <laughs> yes, he does. Oh, look, look, look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <sighs> I take props where I can, even if I'm Will D. Oh. You know, maybe we'll see you. Um, you didn't play enter the Arcadian. tournament ever? You didn't, see into the Ar you didn't enter the Arcadian. Uh, yeah, okay, no, but this is a, this is a classic Bailey mm -hmm. brain moment, mm -hmm. and by Bailey brain I mean dumb brain. Yep. I literally just forgot that it's Melbourne time zone, and so I was like, ah, time for the arcade. And I I checked Twitch, and it's already halfway through. And I'm like, oh. fuck, I'm an idiot. <laughs> yeah. No, so no, 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 that was time. literally the reason I didn't. I I had entered. I was oh. seated fiftieth. Yep. Caleb was seated like fifth. I was like, <laughs> I'm Look. never lost with this guy in tournament. Okay, but, um. Right. Well, we, we don't talk about Caleb at the Arcadian. <laughs> yeah, true. Oh, didn't he drown? Like, did he just go 0-2? Yeah. Yeah. Seated 5th or whatever he was. 8th, I don't remember. But yeah, much better tournament. I was definitely like 50th. Alright, Caelan. Whatever. Actually, uh, you remember um, last BAM? When like yeah. after... Initially, they were like... they seated, I think they seated top 64 and they just didn't bother. Yeah, oh, and, and Stores was over Will D. That was the best thing of my life. Sorry, you no, go. I was, I was, and like, there were a lot of complaints. So, like, I remember like, Caelan was getting very... It was like... I Why do people care, care about uh, like yeah, nobody, nobody? You're gonna drown. <laughs> you're gonna drown in pools. <laughs> Look, I can I can understand from like a um interstate point of view. Like you don't want to swap mm. around because then you like have some. Different Catherine got like done her. dirty or whatever. With <laughs> Catherine didn't really. Get, she didn't even really get done. Dirty. It's not so much, like it wasn't intentionally done dirty. Like she no, had, but she had I, a good I, 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 it didn't, yeah, it's it, like she was just a sacrificial lamb to that, um, our ignorance. That uh, what's his name? That yeah, the Spanish guy that was like yeah, that was good. He was good. Um. That came, he came like not top eight, but he came. No, he didn't. He came like twenty. I think he came twenty fifth. I think he came twenty fifth. Oh, okay, I thought he came like, like top twenty. Um, at the end of the day, like you know, Catherine was looking pretty close against him as well. She could have. Damn. She was a little bit better. She could have. Um, I hate to see that. Actually, did you see her set against um? Yeah, oh, I was on stream against I that know. um. I it was like Dava Peach. Uh, Vincent. It was very funny. I was in a different mindset at Bam. Ah. Oh. Which happens every major, but. For good reasons. I miss Bam so much. I know. I'm. I was so sad. It was. I was. There was so many people that I just wanted to like. Like, Phantom was sick, hanging out with all, like all the boys, and then yeah. you didn't get that in Bam. You, didn't, you know, like there was no Bam. There was no like. There's no yeah. no big cheats this year. I We're gonna have to wait till like. I said to week. Jack earlier. All quarantine, no Bam made Bailey a very <laughs> dull boy. Yep. I heard about a, t a tournament oh. which was reseeded mid tournament. What the? the two two friends. Friends. Same city. You go to the pools. No, see that happens to us. We do we team kill all the time. That's yeah. what we call it team killing, right? Yeah. Where it's just like people that you play literally all the time just get seated against each other in like pools or like just out of pools and you're like, cool. Like <laughs> one of us is gonna get owned, we flew out this way for no reason. Mm, I, I feel like I feel like most TOs do a good job of like avoiding. Probably. That. I think most you you can meet you, uh, you meet them in bracket. Also times. unpredictable losses happen and whatever. I think yeah. it's like um if it's like your own state, it's like what, well, like. But I think like most people have the idea of like, well, this person's actually put a lot of time, effort, you know, money. Well, maybe not time, but like effort and money, like coming out here. We'll make sure that like, yeah, they at least play different people. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. I think like yeah, I know myself as well. When I'm doing like seating, like we don't, we don't just like 
see it and be like, yeah, I think this person's better than this. Like, there will be times where we're like, well, this person is technically better than this person, but yeah, like, we don't that want. results in the same state clash. So we'll put that person like one spot above or below to like ensure yeah, that they're good. playing different and like, yeah. So you're saying you think about it a lot more than Kalen does. No, I think Kalen, Kalen puts a lot of thinking. He just didn't want to put thinking into like... You can say it. Top, you can he didn't say want to put, it, didn't want to put thinking okay. in top 65. But you know, he backed down and he did. He put a bit... He went for it and he like... I didn't, did he, he actually? Yeah, no, he did. Yeah, no. Yeah. I, I was just bagging the man because no? I want to bag the man. Look, I was... You know, um, they put a lot of effort into making a enjoyable tournament experience and we appreciate they, they them did. for it. They always um, do. Bam is always a I very... I love Bam. Yeah, no, it's a I'm very... i singing its praises. It's, it's always a consistent yeah. like quality as well. You never... Like, I will, I will say, SA's gone a lot better, over, you know, over the years in our majors. Yeah, since um, I joined, I, I would agree, SA has Some of the um, early majors were, I will say those, those were SA, SHEC majors. Yeah. SXC was... Um, yeah, I heard SXC was... <laughs> colorful shirt with no head and I knew it must be Kai. Yes. Um, well, it could have been Kai or Ruben, to be you know, fair. I was, about, I, know, I was about to say, I was, when I was sitting down, this is like early in the, um, I was doing like, I was seeing like Kai sitting down there, because he's blonde now. I thought yeah. it was Ruben. I went up yeah. and I was about to say, hey man, and like Kai's just like... Because yeah. I'd already said hi to Kai before. It's like Ruben works now, mm -hmm. weekends like me. Mm -hmm. So it's like, uh, like he'd probably be able to make cheese leagues, but most we're thinking of making Wednesday evacs when we go instead of Fridays. Okay. Because I work Friday, uh, Ruben works Friday. Will D and Brad only want to go when we go, sort mm -hmm. of thing. Usually, so oh. sometimes they don't. I see. I see. Will D and, and Brad on Friday a decent amount. Yeah. Of time, yeah. So. Yeah. Well, the, they always ask. They're always yeah. like, when yeah. are you guys coming in? And yeah, we're you like, always want. You always, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I didn't mean that they won't come with us. I know, I know, I know. Uh, but we've realized we can all kind of make Wednesday. So we're thinking of just coming in Wednesdays. Uh, you know, Wednesday is probably um, one of the lesser populated days for EVAC. But you know Absolutely. what? Absolutely. If enough people go to Wednesdays, it won't be that way. We're, we're going to turn Wednesdays into the new Fridays. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We're going to start doing filthy tournaments on Wednesday. Maybe I'll, I'll actually enter one. Maybe, maybe. Problem is, Eve, uh, Ultimate's doing their tournaments, their weeklies now on Wednesday. They've given up Friday. We'll do it in the Rainbow Room. <laughs> Rainbow thought, Room? I thought Wildy was your Smurf. No, Wildy is a real human. Yeah. Wildy is an important human. Oh, that's true. No, it's not my Smurf. He's my friend. I was just aliasing. It's not Smurf, it's Smurf. Smurf? What is Smurf? Smurf? Dyslexic, man. That sounds, that sounds, that sounds, that sounds dirty. Yeah, uh, th that, that sounds, sounds like, like Muff. Well, which yeah, is, yeah. Which is dirty. Well, Smurf. I think. Maybe. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. We don't know. Should we end this here, Muscat? Probably. There's not really much else. Well, at this point, we're just babbling about random... Well, I've been doing that since I got on commentary. The, the, While I, I was the, commentating Grand Finals, I was the, babbling. At, at the end of the day, that is commentary. Sometimes you sit in there and you're like, I'm not, am I going to give play? Am I going to give my knowledge and expertise about the game? Fuck yeah, no. but also, it w I, I didn't know it was Grand Finals. <laughs> I, I didn't expect... I, didn't, I thought it would be you, Kai. Yeah. So when I saw yeah, you, Brad, I immediately was like... Well, I remember right after well, the thing, I remember right in, after we're right in losers' finals. Right after beating Kai, I was just thinking to myself when I was walking down, God fucking damn, it's going to go to game ten, isn't it? Like yeah, Grand's going to go to game ten again. I'm yeah, like, Muskie. Uh, sorry, uh, Jack said that he was like, "Yep, at least we get we, we know the tournament's going to end around dinner time." <laughs> we start at free now, so we don't have any of these like nine p.m., nine thirty p.m. Ending. I I still trust if it was you versus Kai, it would, yeah, yeah, it we'd still find would a way. have ended by now. No, I, I I love playing Kai and having everyone in the crowd being like. I'm I hungry. Go home. I, I, I'm I, I, hungry. You know, my, my full process has always been, you know what? You want to end it early. You stand out. You sit up there. You maybe win a few more sets, and you know change the course of the thing. Maybe, maybe. Yeah. And you know, and you know, someone did that. Yeah. Someone did it, Brad. Brad, that's you true. Won a few more sets. Yeah, true. People should step up and start winning. Mm -hmm. I'm not people, by the way. No. You your role is here in the commentary. Commentary. And Dude, you hit me with that at the I, one of the big cheese after I was, parties. I look. I will, I will say this. And that I, was I will, the rudest thing you've ever said I will, to me I will, I will say this. I will say this. I will say this. It was very poorly worded. <laughs> we were you very have, drunk. Have to, have we were very drunk. That, you have to believe, though, there wasn't actual malice in there. I'm saying it now. There wasn't actually... It was just oh, very, I did, drunk, very poor, Musky, we yeah. were very drunk. Yeah, I, don't, um, I, don't, I don't think you've ever said malintent to me in your life. Oh. So, at least I hope not. At, to my face. Okay. No, I don't behind, trust behind your back, I'm yeah, just like, probably. man, fuck that guy. Probably. Fuck that, yeah. He thinks he's so good. He's I won. Well, thanks, Lemon. Thanks. That's I don't give him plural. Slemon. <laughs> yep, Lemon. Yeah. Actually, you know what? Lemon's another great comment. You know, we could have could have had grand finals with um. Yeah. I keep slipping and sliding down this chair. 
We could have grand finals. What? Grand finals um, commentary with you and Liam. That would have been an agio rally. No, me and Lemon do not work at all. You don't? Okay. It's too, I love Lemon. It, it's too. It's Ooh, like too casual, or like too memey. I feel like there's um. There's like a like a communication barrier between okay, me and yep. me and Lemon's brains. Yep. I feel like we're both. I think he's a very funny fellow. We I don't want to say I, we're both very funny yeah, because yeah, yeah, you're, you're both. I think he's a very funny fellow. Just we're different polar opposites. Look, funny, Lemon's charismatic. It's definitely, definitely very wa right wing humor. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> no, I don't, he's, he's not. I just <laughs> felt like that was a really funny way of. Well, you got you got you got to find a way to you know describe it somehow. You don't want to babble. Yeah, well, yeah Le Lemon's right very wing. advocate of. The US right wing. I'll say that much. Look, man. Aren't we all? Uh, aren't we all? <laughs> in this world. <laughs> one more. One, <laughs> four more years. <laughs> Please no. <laughs> Please yeah. no. Four more years. Four more <laughs> no, years. I'm not doing that. <laughs> I'm not doing that. I got in an avid drunken conversation about Ruben. Uh, not about Ruben. With Ruben mm. about US politics. And that never will go well ever. Drunken conversations about US politics oh, is just going to be horrible. Any politics. Any, yeah, I was about, like, any, like. Yeah, so. well, the problem is Australian politics is almost like resignation. We're like, yeah, but I feel like if we get reelected again, if we they? all, I feel like a lot of us are in the same bus with Australian politics. Mm -hmm. So when we get drunk and talk about it, it's just very quick and over with. Mm. Oh, do I <laughs> so Reef is actually reasonably like right. Mm. Just go, just go. He's like, point is like he he has um some different views to Kai, and this is like mm. years ago. I remember like um. <laughs> I remember, like, one of the, um, after parties or something, yeah, the, um, this is, like, I don't know, one of the Sydney, I think it was maybe 2000, very 2017, true, sorry, 2018. Anyway, Reef was like, yeah, no, I want to have a conversation with Kai. I want to sit down, like, at, like, Big Cheese and have a conversation with Kai about politics, and I think I can sway him. And I just remember being like, yeah. no. You can sway Kai. I'm like, no, I don't think, I, I don't think, I don't think there's a world where, I, I, I love, I love Reef. I was like, no, you're not gonna. I was like, um, yeah, uh, yeah. He, he, he apparently did have something that, it, it, you know, he did not. I miss Ree. I would, I always get he always houses me. I always get to hang out and like Yeah it's Dan. um he has a very I really like he has a very clean house now. Like <laughs> when I like when I went I've heard the stories. Yeah, it's, it's like he put some yeah. He's got a clean house now. No pizza boxes everywhere. No pizza box yeah, no. No towers of pizza boxes. Yeah, um to be honest, I, I always found it's like old place fine. It was like the pizza box is a bit of a you know, but it's like Reef seems like a cool dude. He is, no, he's I, I, I feel like I've had one conversation with him ever, and it wasn't deep enough to gauge anything. But I was just like, hey, he's probably a cool dude. He's Everybody very, said he yeah, He's very chill, sure, very relaxed. He's just. Okay. Um. Oh. Okay. Are we do for another PM? Yeah. True. True. Do we do we cut the stream? I've been saying cut the stream for a while. I feel like we cut the stream. Unless you can think of another conversation topic, I feel like we cut it. We just end it here. Yeah. We, you know. Who's Takano? Ticano, um, T K, whatever it is, because I see I see that person. He's from Vic. He everywhere um, on Funny Sons. He Twitter. does he does a lot of um, video editing sort of cool. like stuff. He does some really good um, PR videos actually for Vic. Dope. Um, he plays Marf. He's an up and coming Marf. I'd say he's low mid ish right now, but there's always room for like improving. Like he's on the he's, he's on, on the my come level. Up. Yeah, around that I'd say, around that maybe a little bit lower. I'm a bit lower. No, he's he is. Oh. <sighs> Take that one, Takano. Yeah. Yeah. Look. He's yeah. the guy making a documentary for a school, but it was cut. Okay. Uh, who's the person that was that Skip that did the Campbell keyboard one? I'm you not know, sure, Campbell. Did yeah, no, I know. I know what you're talking about. I'm not sure. Actually. I think it was Skip. That was that was the actually funniest piece of melee content I've seen in my life. <laughs> Can't be hitting leg dashes. <laughs> uh, yeah, that was pretty funny. I'm. How do I end this? How do you? How do you? How are you signing off? Goodbye. Goodbye. Farewell. Do I just exit, or do I just? I feel. I feel like we. Um. You know what? Wait, 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 wait. Maybe you would have Oh yes, yes, responsible. <laughs> Damn, you guys went for a while. Good stuff. Well, I mean, it was just, it was mostly just um him it? and Havoc, and then I came along. Yeah, fair was, enough. It was like um. It's um, good to be back. Yeah, yep, yep. Feels um, good to be back. Let me say that. I'll be the first one to say that. We're having actual tournaments run on in person. We don't. There's no um lag that the players are in fact not experiencing. The um. See, I think there is some truth to like rollback still not being 
It's not perfect. It's, it's not perfect. perfect. It's not perfect. They're right. definitely like. It's way better than what we used to use, mm. though. Um, and like you can, there's definitely still like taunts ring run on it. There's definitely like some sets where it's just like iffy. Like there's just not, especially if they're, like one person has to be like streaming for like. Oh yeah, 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 it's yeah. Like, that you know, that thing. I think that's the real issue with online tournaments mm. right now. It's like there's no good way to broadcast it, yep. so we have to do these really roundabout methods. Like I know, um, McLeod said it himself when he was when he won that set against Smopop, um, it was just like Smopop was experiencing a lot of lag because he was the one that had to be streaming, and it was just like. Wait, why did you get the guy in Queensland to stream? Well, because McLeod couldn't stream. He didn't have good enough internet or something. Okay. Well, so he couldn't. Uh, even like I don't know. Point is, he wasn't able to um, stream it. So yeah, yeah. Uh, Smopop was like sort of able to, but it created a really iffy experience and like. That, yeah, that sucks. Mm. Anyway, though. Yep. Um, how did you feel about your matches? Just quickly, because I'm sure Bailey asked you about it, too. Oh, no. <laughs> no? Okay. No. All right, how do you feel? Um, no, I, I, like, I feel like our set like, was the same as, like... Apart from, like, Game 5, where it was, like... There was one stock where you just, like... You got hit a bunch and, like... It, you, like, basically got zero to death, and then, it like, the lead just blew out too much. On Game 5, there was, like... Uh, I think the second last stock, I just, like got a bunch of neutral runs over and over again and then like right, yeah. yeah but apart from that like every game I feel like every game it's like very similar to how our sets normally go where they're like yeah, last like that. last like stock like we're both um I think there was like periods where like I was so like on like get up I was like trying to bait out a spot dodge and like then there was a period where you started just like immediately acting out like not spot dodging but just like calling yeah, out my yeah. dash back I, I did a lot and of then like, the bad wake ups things so, like the um like it was good. Like it was like bad wake ups initially, but then you started like um, just calling out my dash back. Oh yeah, out. yeah, yeah. And yeah, then yeah. The, then in the last two games, you started going back. You started regressing to like spot dodging, and I was yeah. just catching those out. I yeah. think there was like one thing at the very end where like I was expecting you to try and call me out, and I just ran up and up smash, and it hit you because you were trying mm. to. Go, and then like no, I I would have done a laser there. Maybe okay, yeah, because yeah. yeah. um, that's what I was having trouble with today. I think was like mm -hmm. uh, just having kind of lasers that were effective and mm. because I didn't have a good time pinning down foxes today I didn't have a good time like I don't know it, it, it seemed really hard to hit both you and Brad today mm. uh, I think I was just like maybe I just don't shoot lasers on that play maybe right. I just don't shoot lasers on that play because I'm trying to practice other stuff, but yeah. now that we're back, it's like I can't play like that. I have to actually like put a laser in the right spot, um, yep. and also like bait the fox to going to the platform because mm. like <clears throat> that's one thing I at the like moment when I'm shooting a laser, like the fox is nowhere near it, right? And um, when I do try full hop lasers, they never jump into them, so it's, yeah. Yeah. so I, I'm wasting a lot of opportunities because my lasers aren't doing much. Mm. Um, yeah, and I really felt it against Brad, who was just like jumping, just yep. jumping over them, not like double jumping, but just jumping over when he needed to, and he wasn't uh, he wasn't getting caught by like one laser approaches, no. and so I, I just played terribly because of that. Yeah, like, I just didn't do more than one laser approaches. Mm. So he was. It is what it is, and Brad was playing pretty good today as well. Like my set against him. Um, I was talking about him. I was actually talking a lot about um, this to him afterwards, not so much to Bailey, like on here. But like, Brad was just like he maintains a very consistent level of punish game. Mm. Whereas against like he I was is uh, definitely getting a bit better with it because he. It seems like instead of um, instead of going for like cash outs, mm. it seems like he does those types of moves in spots where you think he's actually just going to go for like a larger punish than he does. Yeah. Instead of just being this thing that he does because he's nervous, mm. it's actually happening more for him in situations where the opponent actually doesn't want it to happen. Yep. Right? Instead of just being like, oh, cool, I only got hit once. Yeah, no, I completely agree. But sometimes you get hit once and it's like, this is actually worse because I did the wrong thing. That's what happened a couple times against him for me was... I like blew a bunch of techs because I thought he was going to do an up there. Yeah, 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 you think, you and think and he's the right thing. He just up smashed me for it. Mm. That's alright though. Um, no, it's, uh, I don't know. I mean, it's it's going to be like really interesting these next like few tournaments. Like, especially mm. when we get people like, say, Ruben back, like McLeod on the come up. Mm. Um, I want to hit the fucking training mod again. Didn't, didn't yes. do that enough in the break. Mm. Um, Did a lot of net play. Didn't do a lot of training mod though. I am. See, I, I feel like I did a decent amount. I'm, like, happy with, like, my myself, like, 
certain things I'm improving on, like JC, like hitting grounded JC shines and like yep. ledge dashing. Because I think there's like those spots where I was like, um, too trigger happy on the ledge dash against you. But there was spots I like, did call that out a couple yeah. of times. Yeah. Um, it's like, but they're also like, especially early on, there were like some spots where like, it's like if you just um if you grab ledge and they side B high, um you can just ledge dash and you just like punish it and. The idea is what you should be doing. If they, you wait it out, and then if they like up B, then you just like double jump and refresh, and then go from there. Instead of yeah. just problem is when you up, when you put yourself in position up B, I was like spooked. And I was, yeah. I got like spooked, and I just immediately ledge dash, and then you just go you grab ledge, and it's like, well, yeah, okay. you get that. Free. Anyway, that makes sense. Um, I don't know. It's gonna be a good time. It's gonna mm. be a good time because we're gonna be running tournaments a bit more often now, yeah. which is good. Yep. And. Um, I want to get Nick into a tournament again. That'd be mm -hmm. good. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, we just need a bit more people to show up. And also, I'm still just garbage against Fox. Pardon? I'm still just garbage against Fox. Uh. <laughs> That's like, I keep learning it over and over, right? It's like, <clears throat> um, I don't like, I don't play in two different ways. You know, like mm. the way I play is kind of, a lot more accommodated for playing as a floaty and playing okay. as a slow floaty. Yeah. Yeah, especially like Peach. Mm. Um, the way I play is kind of designed to like set me up in a spot that they have to move towards, mm -hmm. essentially. Yeah. But like Fox doesn't have to. No, no, yeah, no. Yeah, he, he has so many ways to like. He just down. wait. He just like moves out of the range and then moves back in the range. Yeah, yeah. It's like so. Yeah. There's like either, either on the ground or with the floor. Yeah, no, yeah right? he can he can like because he can do it like vertically and horizontally. He can choose. Yeah, like yeah. So, many, like so that's been my problem. Is like I'll try to set myself up in a spot I think that like the fox should go, mm -hmm. and then I get punished for doing that. And so what needs to happen is I actually have to force them to um, not just react but commit to something that I can yeah. read. Because mm. right now it's like. The things that I'm fishing for don't land, and when they do land, they're not like getting much else off of it other than the Yeah, it's hit. like, yep. Um, because the way I'm hitting foxes right now seems to be I catch a, like a double jump or a full hop with like one aerial, hmm. and every other like thing that I try doesn't get me like what I want. So I think just in the future I need to. Like put out a one laser and then like do some micro adjustments to my positioning mm -hmm. and then like I can check them with another laser if I need to yeah. and then I can like start to assess whether the next approach needs to be to hold the position mm -hmm. or to like approach on their position okay yeah sure yeah so that's what I'm failing with Fox right now is like I'm not assessing what he's doing fast enough because his decisions come like after my, like, you know, my level one, mm -hmm. right? And I'm not getting him to play level two, so, mm -hmm. you know. I mean, the thing is, like, this is stuff that, like, this is stuff that you can, like, See, work Zara, on net play. Yeah, right? yeah. See, Zara has a good point here, because, like, they're asking, why do I think my play style is focused on traps for floaties when there aren't many floaties to play against um, compared to fast fallers? Uh, that's actually the opposite in Adelaide. <laughs> There's only one good fox, and that's you and, and Brad now. Yeah, really Brad's well. Three, but he's like and like these are completely like the way you and Brad both play play nothing like Victorian foxes yes. or Queensland foxes. Yes, uh, I'd say we probably play the most like Perth because we're both pretty insular in our metas, mm. um, and so I don't get to play against foxes that like like when they get hit by a laser they'll still commit to playing neutral for the next ten seconds mm. like. I'm not used to playing against foxes that actively don't want to like end the neutral quickly. Yep. Like, I think that's the problem everyone has here. Is like we all want to end the neutral quickly. Yes. And we don't want to like, we don't want to play this game where it's like you're actually trying to like predict the thing that's going to happen instead of just being like, well, if I'm fast enough here, I know I'll hit, yeah. so I'll, I'll, I'll do it, right? Like, yeah, gotta, if I'm gotta, fast enough, I know I know. I gotta say that, 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 I've been thinking about this like <laughs> recently as well, and like, yeah, that that really sums up like something I need to work on, like that specific, like getting out of that mindset at times, being like, okay, I'm gonna if like being like, oh, the answer here is just to be a little bit faster, hit that yeah, a yeah, little bit yeah. faster. If I like, if I just or like, you know, even just faster. Oh, if I just dashed a little bit more instead of thinking yeah, about like, yeah, yeah, or, or I could have just shielded at the yeah. right time. It's like instead of thinking about like. 
you know, doing multiple steps to get to your position. It's like, well, if I just do this one thing, but like change it slightly, it's like, oh, yeah. if I just like overshoot it a bit more, then it'll work. Yeah, I don't think there's like a level of stopping to assess and try and outplay like the problems you're mm. having in the set. I don't think there's like many people doing that in the kind, like, um. well, in an Adelaide probably specifically, right? And I'm guilty of it too. Like, mm. there's times where, um, there's times where like I actually can do that though, and when I do do that, like I I see the like fox player start to fall apart a bit because they're like they're actually getting mixed up, right? Yeah. Like they're actually getting like something that puts them out of their comfort zone. Mm -hmm. um, so I think just like once we play a bit more, we'll start to play less of this like if I was fast enough I would win here, right? And it'll start to come down to more neutral interactions because mm. we'll like we just need to we just both need to like practice the punish more and then we need to like when we play like Actually, try to right, yeah. bait. <laughs> thing like is, actually bait and whip yep. punish that kind of thing. That'll take time. That'll like I feel like it's like something that I think we both can like definitely like improve and we can like achieve and work on. It's like it'll take time. It's like it's not gonna be just like. I think my punish is decent on Fox. It's mm. just a bit uh, too dependent on having the right read. I didn't hear the last part. Sorry. I think it's too dependent on having the right read or being ready for the right read. Okay. Yeah. Because uh, right now it's like. I'll get a knockdown and then I'll put myself in a spot where like I could probably do turn around up to it e either way mm -hmm. or shine if I want to. Mm. At the moment, like they sometimes they can just tech right and just shine me for that. Good games, man. Hey. Do you have to work? Yeah. Oh, okay. All right. Yeah. Thanks, man. Thanks for holding it down, by the way. Yeah, yeah I loved it. Um, all right. Well, That's I should good. probably pack up because. Yep. We've been shooting this shit for a while. But thanks, yep. everyone, for stopping by. Uh, yeah, Hawaii definitely. SSBM actually hosted us earlier. Oh, yeah, I heard. Um, so that was really cool. Right, the awesome. VODs for this tournament will be on the YouTube channel we just put in the chat. So I'll probably cut those up, like, in the next week. And we will see them online. Uh, also, this year, or well, going into next year, I'm planning on trying to get, like, more people into kind of signing on. Well, not signing, but, like, more people into... Uh, committing to like a content plan with me because mm. I feel like I've already done enough in terms of like making um, Smash and Adelaide sustainable. Mm -hmm. I think we've done a pretty good job of doing that already. But what I want now is to have more like global uh, reach. I want people to like maybe sometimes remember that there's like a stream going on in Adelaide and then maybe check a channel every now and then. Mm. Like if I can get one more person to do that just by um, making YouTube videos of uh, me and like other people in the scene, mm. then it will help feed us, like make a nice little feedback loop because yep. I want to be able to like promote the personalities that have been part of the scene for a while sure. now and um, then feed it back into getting exposure on the bots. That's what I want to do for the next year. I'm coming for, I'm coming for big wind beer. <laughs> all right, that's a good, that's a good way to end it. Yep. All right. All right. Thanks for watching, everyone. Yep. Love you lots. Um, I'll host off to another stream though. You can find me on Twitter at KP Kaiser. I always tweet when I go live. So if you want to watch some melee in the off time, um, you can tune in there. So check out the vods. Check out my Twitter. And we'll see you next time, everyone. It was really good having you here. We will be back with more Melee tournaments in the future as well, so follow for more of those. And I'm going to host you off to Spudhunter. He's playing some Diabotical, and I've just been on a Diabotical binge. So he's just getting into the game now, and I hope you have a good time watching him. All right, love you all, everyone, and peace out.